Welcome back to the stream, guys, and of course, welcome back to SnowRunner, welcome back to a brand new week, and welcome back to a brand new Monday. Now, I am super pumped to see a bunch of you guys already out there in the early squad, and no worries, we're going to be going over a bunch of new things today. We're going to be going over all of the topics that you guys are excited about, including console mods, updates, new maps, hauling, mudding, trailing, all of that good stuff is going to be going over very, very, very soon. So, without any further ado, I am going to go ahead and start saying hello to you guys out there in the early squad. We got Fordman, not Seth, Diesel Added, we got Brody, we got Remington, we got Edward, we got Max, we got Colton, Maddie, Seth Mountain Bikes, we got Jaden, we got Christina, we got Zaya, we got Master, we got Trey, Samuel, Torin, Juicy, Phantom, Austin, The Boss 43, D Max for Life coming for you, and let's see, Benjamin and Dominic and Pittsburgh Rail Fan and Lone Wolf and Christian and Mr. Nut. What is going on, my dude? We got Levi and Cameron and Darnell and Paul and Jake15, Max, Edward, Brody once again, Javon, and we got Halsinator as well out there in the chat. We got SV, we got Akisa, we got a, the, your boy Maddie checking in once again. You bet. Diesel Addict is out here, bro. We got Joseph and Rick and, let's see, Busted RCs. We got Cage and Rob SnowRunner and Chance and Sea Dog Gaming and Parker and, let's see, uh, Lorenzo. I think that's how you pronounce that. And, by the way, you guys, thank you so much for dropping by in the early squad today. We genuinely appreciate it. We got, uh, let's see, Colton and Michaels and Jason Trucker and Scrap Metal and Boy22. We got Akisa, we, once again, saying hi. We got Jackson. We got Stefano. We got Boston. We got John. We got Bobby. We got Cole. We got, let's see, Cameron and Carter and, let's see, once again, we got Lucas and Madison and Joseph. Joseph and Keller, and there's a lot of different Josephs out there in the chat, so that's why I'm kind of, uh, kind of saying hi to multiple Josephs, but we got Freedom, we got Bo 12 Bob, we got, let's see, Squad Officer AK, we got, uh, who else we got out there, we got Craig, we got Jesse, we got, uh, Kyle, we got Killstreak, we got Jackson, we got Jesse, we got Has the Skills out there in the chat, we got Penguin, we got Nathan, we got Keller, and Calvin, and Rich, and Cameron, and Trey, and Victor, what is going on, all of you guys, thank you all so much for stopping by today, we got over 200 people out here on the stream already, which is massive, thank you so much for stopping by, we got Ghost, we got Ryan, we got Kane, we got Xander, Jesse, Christian, Logan, Ethan, Simon, Hayden, Michael, Aryan, and let's see, we got Sarah Blix as well. We got Calvin and Maria and Victor and Graham and Carter, and we are about to go ahead and kick off today. Now, with all that being said, as far as the latest in console mods go, let's see, when are you going to stream the limit again? Um, actually, pretty soon, probably. But with that being said, you guys, let me just go ahead and make sure and verify that y'all have game audio, which I believe you do, and also check this out. So, so, no more controller disconnections. I finally made the upgrade and am now actually finally using a proper wireless Xbox One controller in this, like, bright electric green. I really, really like it, but as you can see, it works great. No wire to worry about, and it's not going to disconnect and create a bunch of Hammond moments. So, with that being said, we're also going to dive into some of the newest console mods as of right now. Now, one of the latest trucks that you guys definitely need to check out is the Blitzo truck for console. This thing has been approved. It is a flatbed OBS Ford, and it is 100% console friendly, and it is on consoles right now. Make sure you go ahead and sort your console mod browser by latest update and the Blitzo truck will pop up once again. And Empower, what is going on out there? And, and McDonald's, hi, this is my first live stream. Thank you so much for making this your first live stream. Thank you so much for stopping by. We genuinely appreciate it out here. And we got Diesel Addict out there in the chat uh, laying down some of the rules as per usual, but it's all good. David Herbie, uh, 5389, what is going out there in the chat? Oh, my dude, no more unintentional yeeting. Ah, don't worry about it. Dude, you guys are absolutely about to blow through 300 people out here on the stream right now, and you're also about to blow through that first 100 likes mark that is freaking amazing and let's say omg right exactly uh do you know when the console gets the br uh gets the brulee hopefully very soon but that's something that we're definitely gonna need to see about in the future but once again the blitzo truck for console is on console now also just to go ahead and clarify for you guys as far as the latest console trucks go the ix8 slot semi-trailer is also available along with the rng 50 or RNG G53, which the RNG G53 is a little bit different, but if you once again sort by latest updates, you will see the RNG G53 right here, and it is basically a remake of one of the most uh, loved fan favorite trucks from the original Spin Tires. Obviously, it's based on it, but in a more console-friendly version, so if you want to relive some of those original Spin Tires memories, definitely check out the RNG G53. It is now fully available on consoles a Along with, like I said before, of course, the Blitzo truck for consoles, which is a flatbed Ford OBS. Now, let's go ahead and filter once again, and I'm going to actually 
make sure that I'm back on subscribe mods only. And we got a bunch of things to go over today. Now, one of the things we've got to go over today is obviously the highway map. We're going to be advancing a lot further in highway hauling in multiplayer with Diesel Addict. We're actually going to get him get him in here on a VC real quick. I've also talked with the developer of uh, this map of highway hauling, which is Remo667. And he has actually informed me that he has plans to expand this into uh, a lot more basically a lot more depth and i'm not going to go ahead and give any of that away but just know this is going to be a much deeper series on highway holland than you guys may think coming later on in the future hayden dakota and razor and marker games what is going on out there and billy and lennox as well what is going on my dudes thank you so much for stopping by let's go ahead and get diesel addict in on this vc and we are going to go ahead and kick off and have some fun now you guys you guys have been really good about letting me know as far as the sound back and forth, as far as our conversations go, and let me know with that once again, but also, uh, we found some guys last time that were, like, straight up trolling, so I, I get if you're, like, if you're if you're really wanting to help with the sound, but at the same time, if we know that everybody can hear us, don't be like, ah, uh, we can't hear you at all, but then again, if that is a problem, like an actual problem for you, I would suggest adjusting your volume, but Trad Doge, what is going on, Aiden and Dawn and Logan and Dakota and Owns Plays and Razor and Carson Ford, what is going on, my Dudes, but we got Diesel Addict in the VC now. What is up? How's it going today, TC? Good, good, good. Just kind of, I got my, uh, I got my coffee here, so I've got, I've got my water, <laughs> I've got my cold brew, and I am ready to go. I buy this cold brew by the jug. Is that bad? Uh, potentially. Uh, but I mean, I have, I have Coca-Cola sitting with me every stream, so. Ah, uh, don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Let's see. Oh, that would be cool, Rifts. Yeah, definitely add some realistic mods to that. That would be a really good one for a playthrough. Now, as far as the mods that we had on before, I definitely want to make sure that we have the mods we had on before, but I'm going to add the Blitzo truck to that lineup, okay? So, All right, that sounds good. I'm thinking, I know that before, let me go and see what's on right now that I need to make sure is enabled, but... Oh, actually, wow, apparently it's just all on. Um, then let me go to my mod browser then and just see what all I have. I have Blitzer Truck, Limes F450, Highway Hauling, obviously. And, oh, wait a minute. I need to sort by uh, enabled only. I don't know why I, I keep forgetting I can do that. But generic 2020 dually, we know that works. And uh, did we go into multiplayer with the new console-friendly Berlay, the Type S, uh, Type S100? Um... We didn't actually, and I don't have that one actually. Okay, I'm gonna turn that one off. Um, 63 mega, we know that works. Uh, did the Starship F450 work? I'm pretty sure it did. I'm pretty sure it did. But it did, it did work last time. Okay, cool. Uh, we got Brentley and Veronica and Pioneer and Hossinator. What is up? Oh, audio all good, bud. Thank you so much, Hossinator. I really appreciate that, my dude. Already, you guys have blown through that first 100 likes mark, creeping up on the 200 mark, and you've also blown through that 350 mark, creeping up on 400 people out here on the stream already. That is absolutely wild, you guys. All right, I'm going to go through the... Let's see, what else is on? We got the Powerhouse. We got the... Let's see, we got the Powerhouse, the IV K100A. The Tow Pig, the K30, the Yeet Mobile, the 3880, and Red's trailers. I think we're pretty much good to go. Yeah, that sounds about right. Yeah, that sounds right to me. We've also got the CCM CORR uh, and the CCM DC73. I'm sure you have both of those, pretty sure. Mm -hmm. The DC73, that was the lifted the, charger, right? Yeah. Samuel and Thomas, okay. what is good out there, you guys? Is the generic uh, 3500 coming to consoles? Hey, I mean, most likely, we'll have to see what happens with that, but um, I don't see any reason why not. It'll just have to be one of those things where we uh, where we wait and see. And it's, you know, it's one of those things where I wish I could give a, you know, like a super definitive answer, but unfortunately, sometimes, like, we have to wait and see what the devs do. We have to wait and see what the devs de uh, devs say. Jack D, what is going on? Jennifer Sanders, are there any new console mods? Heck yeah, there are. The Blitzo truck is now available on consoles, which is a flatbed Ford OBS. But also, there is a old spin tires recreation truck, basically a truck that has been revamped from the base uh, old spin tires. And if you guys want to check that out and have some nostalgia, feel free to do that as well. So once again, do you have the CORR? I know you have that, but do you have the DC? Oh yeah, I have that one. Okay. So let's see. I'm going to go ahead and kick this off here and see how everything looks. You're on PTS, correct? Yes. 
Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay, so happy the quad steer is on consoles. Dude, absolutely. Uh, Penguin, hey, it's no worries, my dude. Yo, you guys already blew through that forward, uh, forward of viewers mark on the stream. If you are just joining us today, by the way, massive, massive, massive thanks for being out here. If you guys are just uh, just stopping by in the early squad, once again, thank you so much. We've literally only been live for like 10 minutes so far. Well, 11 minutes so far, but once again, you guys, massive 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 thanks for taking your time and stopping by and i hope you guys enjoy hanging out with us talking about trucks talking about snow runner and just uh having a good time overall and let's see the squad officer ak with the two dollar super chat thank you so much is the highway map coming out on consoles yeah it should have no issues coming to consoles as long as everything goes well uh with its release but let's see what is this oh whoa wait what is my highway map gone oh no because this is this is TNV Trails. Did I wipe my highway map? I might have wiped my highway map. But to be fair, Oops. we did so much, like, uh, like crashing um, that I feel like we could probably, you know, work our way back up to it very soon. Got a holiday today. So hopefully, I'll be here for the whole stream. Heck yeah, Rifts. Thank you so much. Season 2, June 22nd. What have you heard? Question mark. Question mark. Question mark. So there's been a lot of dates floating around, and I've seen, uh, seen them a lot in my comments, um, about p people potentially saying, hey, I know the dates for every release of the, like, of the Season 2 phases, and I'm like, dude, the developers have not confirmed any of that yet, so we have absolutely no idea. No idea. So, if I go yeah, back... Yeah, 100% my... speculation at this point. Yeah, 100%. So, I'm going to have to actually start a new instance of highway hauling, but that's okay. That's okay, because because of the simple fact that when we did highway hauling last... Yo, Remington and Beretta with that $5 super chat. Thank you so much. Is the powerhouse on console, and I'm a big fan of your channel. First of all, thank you so much for your $5 super chat. I genuinely appreciate the support. And secondly, the powerhouse is not on consoles just yet, but it is in line for testing and should have no issues getting approved whatsoever once it comes up in line so any new mods well, once again banana biscuits the latest mod that you guys are definitely going to want to check out is the blitzo truck for consoles which is a obs ford and it's an obs ford flatbed so what we actually have to do right now is make our way to the garage on highway holland and we're going to go ahead and retain the garage and get everything ready to go and then invite diesel addict to our multiplayer playthrough and thankfully it is early morning for us. So being that it's the early morning, we'll have a bunch of time before the sun goes down. But at the same time, this map is also pretty dang fun when the sun goes down. So it's my break from exams. Heck yeah, Mark Black. Thank you so much for being out here. All right, we're going to go ahead and start tracking that lay of the land. And one of the most interesting things, at least to me, is what are you guys hoping that this region expands into? Especially Diesel Addict. Like, where are you hoping we go next? Like, if there was a new world added or like you know let's say for example he expanded highway hauling into a four map or three map region what would you want to see i don't know if it would be possible but a great addition i think would be like an old throwback to the 18 wheels of steel extreme trucker days mm -hmm. in that when you had three different regions you were in alaska australia or well not alaska but you were in the extreme northern regions of the world yeah yeah so like basically the, the you know the great north basically yeah, ice road truckers in a nutshell. Yeah. And you also had South American region and you had Australia. That's I really think seeing, cool. I think seeing a northern, how to put this, an ice road trucker style addition to this map yeah. would be incredible. I would be so down for that. Now, what's interesting is a lot of people have been speculating about some of the upcoming worlds and the upcoming environments within the main game, too. And one that I think I could definitely see becoming a thing is Montana. Um, Montana or maybe like one of the, I don't know, one of the Dakotas. Like pick one, North Dakota, South Dakota, something in that area, especially from like from what they've teased for us. I could see maybe either Montana or one of the Dakotas becoming a, uh, a region where we return to North America. Yeah, I would definitely like to see more of the uh, larger states, for example, in America, like like you said, Montana, um, North, one of the Dakotas, that would be a great thing to see, especially if they brought in logging, because we have trucks like right. the 3880, and you can go right into the deep woods and mm -hmm. just have a ton of fun that way. Well, not only can you go into the deep woods, but yo, what's up, Cody? I see you saying hi out there in the chat, and Jeremiah, I see you saying hi out there as well, and Dawn is literally checking in in the North Dakota squad. What's up, dude? Repping out here. All right, I love it. 
Clancy checking in and saying hi. Thank you so much. Now, one of the other things that I think would be really cool about that, yo, McKinley Brown dropping that 499 super chat. If I'm, uh, thank you, by the way. Thank you so much for that. If I'm sub to mods on mod.io that are console friendly but not on in game list, can I use them? No. So they have to make it from mod.io to your um, to your console mod browser. They need to be approved by the devs before you can use them on consoles. Also, Cyberlin, and Megan, and uh, Blaha? I guess that's how you say your name. Tractor Boy, Poison Snake, and Cody and Jacob all saying hi out there in the chat, and Cyril as well. Thank you guys so much for checking in and saying hi. Now, also, whoa, I just went full on Tokyo Borifto, but <laughs> back to our previous topic. I definitely think, you know, Montana, the Dakotas, those would both be good. I also think Colorado would offer such a varied environment that we could go from, you know, highways to snow-capped peaks in, like, 30 minutes. Well, yeah, exactly. And it also, I think, would give us a, a more accurate way to use rigs like the Pacifics, you know? Mm-hmm. Because, honestly, as good as the Pacifics are, if you take the P-16 into the Yukon region or Wisconsin, it is severely out of its depth unless it gets all-wheel drive upgrades. Well, yeah, and that's what I was about to say. Trucking with Gavin with that 499 Super Chat. Thank you so much. Do you know if, uh, if there is a console-friendly Monster Max or Cat Eye being tested for consoles? First of all, there is a console-friendly Cat Eye on the testing list. I don't know what the testing status is of it yet. And as far as Monster Max goes, all of the mods in the Monster Max series as of right now are uh, are just PC. But I'll keep you guys updated on anything Cat Eye or Monster Max related should we see any console related developments. And once again, thank you so much, Gavin, for that 499 Super Chat. By the way, your mic is quieter than the other person talking. Oh, that's weird. I must have turned Diesel up higher than myself, which is odd because like normally as far as balancing goes, I try to balance us like really, really closely. Um, but I just tried to equal us out a little bit, and hopefully that helps. What's up, Josh's Adventures? And by the way, I am jumping into the Highway Holland Garage now. Okay, so, I'm just watching the stream catch up, and I'm waiting to jump into multiplayer on my end. Okay, I sold all of my DLC, and all I have retained is my 9,000. And the method that we used... Hey, what is going on, dude? Oh my god, you guys just blew through that 500, uh, 500 people mark out here on the stream. Thank you so much for over 500 of you checking in already. I genuinely appreciate you guys being out here. And if you're just joining us today, welcome. We hope you enjoy all of our SnowRunner and truck-related conversation. And hopefully we can have a fun, uh, really just a fun time hanging out and talking to all of you guys. Just having a fun, um, fun conversation back and forth. Now, starting up co-op on the Highway Holland. We can do, comment. do what? With the occasional Pikachu comment. Yes, Pikachu always. Pikachu is always, like, is, is always chosen. We don't even need to include I Choose You because it's assumed already. <laughs> Let's Ugh. see. Kevin92Foxbody says, Game volume is very loud, too loud, louder than your own mic. Uh, that's a little odd. Um, very. That's a little odd because all of my settings are the same settings that I actually used to record earlier today. And I already like I proofed that footage and, you know, and watched it and everything. And the audio was great. So I don't know what's going on. But if it keeps doing that, let me know out there in the chat. Um, all right, Diesel, we are ready to go ahead and take a let's see we should be ready to go ahead and accept a new player i'm gonna go ahead and pick up a blitzo truck so you guys can see what is new on consoles as of today this thing right here is available on consoles as i said earlier um available on all systems xbox and playstation uh playstation sorry playstation the blitzo truck scout it's an obs ford flatbed and it is all good ready to go rebel trx01 with that five dollar canadian super chat what about maine from the states maine would be an interesting place and again it's it's one of those places where i don't think i don't think you really see maine represented in a lot of video games so i don't know i mean did did euro truck ever get any kind of like main uh like I don't know, region? I don't think American Truck ever did. I don't recall offhand, actually. Yeah, I, I really don't think it ever did, at least not to my knowledge. Like, I, now, granted, I'm not, a like, a huge uh, ATS player. I play it sometimes, but I'm not, like, anywhere near as experienced on ATS as I am here. And I feel like they haven't done anything main-related, but that could just be me. 
But this, like I said before, you guys, this is the new Blitzo truck, aka the new um, the new OBS Ford, which is on consoles as of today. And Diesel Addict has made his way into the game. Hey, what happened to the money? Once again, since the update went out, um, yeah, Gavin, uh, thick, thick, thick BFG all terrains for sure. Love these wheels too. But since the recent update for Phase Four, um, it's only it's it's just basically a little glitch where. Um, the un unlimited money can come back. It's just the map creators have to go in and re-enable that line of code. And then once they do that, it should be good to go. Does it have a gooseneck? I'm not sure. That one we definitely have to find out. But I have Red's goosenecks on. So if it does have a gooseneck, we will definitely find it. And we'll definitely see what we can do with it. So I'm also going to see if and when Diesel comes out. First of all, I'm going to park this guy over here next to this 1500. And I'm going to let it chill in a parking space. And then I'm going to build myself a hauling rig as well. Now, he's probably going to build himself a 3880, which I 100% respect. But I'm also going to build myself a sort of a new a new build based on a DLC truck but maybe you know maybe a little bit further along than I've done before I'm also going to build a dually 3500 which this thing I mean you guys know console friendly modern Chevy Silverado 3500 Duramax um this thing is fully console friendly it's not on consoles yet but it hopefully will get approved pretty soon what's the name of the map once again highway hauling bro we'll do highway we'll do lift and we will do Pitbull Duels. And I'm thinking, I don't know if I need the heavy bumper. I really don't know if I need the heavy bumper. It's like not necessarily like super um, necessary for this particular application in my opinion. But let's see. I kind of dig that brown actually. I also dig the burnt orange. They all look really good on this truck. Like there's very few things that, that look bad on this truck. Like pink for example. I'm okay. All right. Uh, yeah. I'll go with the blue. And, oh, did he build a Brigadier? Yeah. Dude, heck yeah. What's up, Gage? I'll see you out there in the chat. I love that Brigadier, dude. I absolutely yeah, it, love it. It is insanely fast for a vanilla truck. Oh, yeah. That's why I'm about to build one. I'm lining up my, um, my, like, scout slash, um, I guess, like, you know, pickup trucks that can do hauling but are not, like, super, uh, super heavy duty. I'm lining them up over here in this parking lot, and it's crazy actually parking this thing next to a normal in-game 1500 and looking at the difference in, like, the textures and the build and everything. It's just wild. But I'm about to go and buy my first semi. X-Ray Trucks, what the heck? Yo, Gavin, it's all good because we actually, like, that just allows people to leave, um, leave the garage at the same time and not have the game go bye-bye and just break and fall to pieces. Is the map on consoles? Not yet, but hopefully very, very soon. Eli Skilden with that 499 Super Chat. Hello there, just got my first, um, oh, God, my, uh, <laughs> first pew-pew YouTube-friendly. Oh, boy. <laughs> but once again, thank you so much for that 499 Super Chat, Eli. I really appreciate it. Let's see. I think a full-size camper or a boat trailer and starter would be lit. What do you think? I would love that. Yo, Mark, I would freaking love that. Now, let's see. Let me also grab a Brigadier of my own. But I also love the International HX, but that's what I used last time. Now, the Brigadier has everything unlocked, which is amazing. And, oh, except for the suspensions. Which, I mean, yep. I'm not really too worried about the suspensions right now. Because, like, we're on a, we're on a hauling map. Like, I'm not, I'm not expecting to need it. Oh, bro, rank 13. Okay. Like, I'm not expecting to need it on a hauling map, but did you go with saddle low? Yeah. And okay. actually, I also added in the uh, 3.8 crane. That was a bad idea. It's oh, was it really? Heavy. Yes. It's extremely heavy. Oh, dear. Yeah, I'm going to do the angled bumper, and I'm going to also do some outrolled exhausts, and I'm going to do a new set of wheels. And I'm going to throw the... Oh, I love the DLC paint job on this thing, man. Let's see. Has the console-friendly Berlay been approved yet? Not yet, but hopefully very, very soon. We're also throwing beans on the dash. Mr. Beans. And we're also going to do... Let's see. Pine Forest right there. Stickers-wise, we'll move it just a little bit further that way. And then we will do the Wild Wolf sticker. And we should be good to go. Oh, oh boy. Great. What's up, dude? What were you saying, Diesel? This thing also drifts nicely. 
Yeah, no, it's actually super good to drift. Are you on highways or are you on um, all terrains? Uh, I'm on all terrains. Yeah, me too. Let's see. Are you going to, uh, to go to Emmer today? I'm not sure about that Empower. And Ray Ray Raymond, what is going on, my dude? And let's see. Remember, tell me about that black fiberglass body toy uh, Toyota with the Gladiator and old spin tires. Holy cow. TZ, what is the story on Beans? So Beans was named by the stream and he just stuck ever since. Let's see. Um, ooh. Holy cow, Banana. That is wild. Let's see. What are the new console mods? I'm glad you asked, Brady, because right here, this Ford OBS has been approved for consoles today and is available on your mod browser. This flatbed Ford OBS, it is so much fun to use, so good to drive, and definitely one that I recommend putting in your garage. All right, now, off to find Diesel. Oh, he grabbed a trailer already. Okay, so I'm gonna help you find some of the, um, some of the watch points, or maybe even we could go out and do that together. But that would be actually, maybe we should go and set off and kind of, you know, locate our watch points, points of interest, uh, tasks that might be important. And I don't know if you want to do that in the 3500 or in the, uh, let's see, what if Beans was made IRL, would you buy it? Bro, that'd be freaking sick. They actually do make, like, little, uh, little bobbleheads like that. It's really cool. What are you building right now, by the way? I'm gonna build the Cat Eye, because it's okay. what I had last time, and I go with the Flex Suspension. Yeah, I mean, it worked pretty well. Let's see, I should probably tell you why I wasn't here Friday. Two words, finals week. Bro, I get that entirely. By the way, guys, thank you so much for basically 600 people out here on the stream right now. If you were just joining us today, first of all, thank you so much for stopping by. And secondly, I really, uh, really hope that you guys are checking your console mod browsers. And I also hope that you're checking them with uh, the sorting set to latest updates because... You have this thing as of today. You have a flatbed Ford OBS as of today. You are also about to blow through and obliterate that 300 likes mark on the stream already, which is freaking wild to me, my dudes. Freaking wild. And let's see. Main, drop of that $2 super chat. Let's see. Um, wish I could conversate with you all here since 250k. Bro, thank you for hanging around for so long and also for supporting the, um, the stream with that $2 super chat. And let's see, yo DC, what's good, bro? Have you seen the new duels for the F450 and the new paint on the Mudcat? I've seen the paint on the Mudcat, and we're definitely going to be using it later. But, but, I have not seen the uh, the new duels on the F450. Uh, is that even in my store? It should be in my store. I really need to check and see, because I'm pretty sure we enabled it. Um, yeah, where it's in the are store. You? Where are you? Where are you? Okay. There's duels on it, apparently, now. Uh, let's yeah, I saw, see. I saw the screenshots he posted yesterday. And now that I think about it, because I didn't know that the Mudcat oh, had a new paint job. He made the tractor tires bigger. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. Let's see. Where are Mudcat's those in here somewhere. I think. Bro. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This man added freaking Super Swamper dualies with you know like fuel wheels i mean this thing is so built oh my god i gotta build myself one of these and pull it outside of the garage because oh this is gonna be incredible and let me see did he add we'll do the uh the dump pipe we'll do the rock lights because obviously it's gonna turn to nighttime at some point so we're gonna do that we're gonna do the steps we're gonna do the smg grill and we're gonna do the aftermarket lights and we're going to do, oh, that's all you get on the fuel wheels. And then, what else do we get? Wow, the amount of colors. I was curious to see if he had added any more colors yet, but let me find a good color option for this thing. I really like the red, and I know that people are going to say, oh, you just add red to everything. And you know what? I I like red, and it looks good. But it just needs dually fenders. That's it. That's it. Let's see. You should, make, you should make beans on the dash merch. That'd be lit. Bro, I'm actually really highly considering that. And also, if you want to actually look at what we have to offer for that, uh, one of the moderators can throw the link to that store out there in the chat. And you can also um, take a look at the links that the moderators throw out in the chat from time to time to get into our Discord as well. God, this thing just needs some dually fenders, and it's going to look so sick. Wow. Look at that. Oh my god, it's a thick boy. Look at that. That's a thick old boy, I'll tell you what. 
That is amazing. Uh, somebody said, are all of these truck options on consoles? No, not yet, but this truck right here is fully available on consoles as of today. The Blitzo truck, aka the Ford OBS, and this is something that we are going to be uh, using today heavily to go ahead and locate some watch points and uh, try to find some new tasks. And somebody's like, that's too wide, and I'm like, nah, don't worry about it. All right, you ready, Diesel? Oh, yeah. All right, let's go find ourselves some watch points. What do you say? Sounds good to me. And All also, right. I don't think the parking brake on that CK1500 works. Probably doesn't. Yeah, probably doesn't. Um, let's see, rear end be thick. Yeah, pretty much. Rear end be freaking thick as heck with, like, five Cs. All right. You want to lead the way? Okay. Let's uh, right now. Oh, God, it's already, like, 14, 42 in the afternoon. Jeez. Jeez. And yes, Xavier, uh, one of the moderators can throw a link to that out there in the chat. Uh, same as our Discord channel, so, or Discord server, Discord channel. But here comes Diesel. I'm gonna let you lead the way, my dude. And I'm so happy we don't have to deal with the, like, phase four, um, uh, what's it called? The frame lag bugs. God, those antennas, exactly. like, the, the antennas bend all the way back when you accelerate. <laughs> This thing should have a ton of power on it. Yeah, those skulls must be so incredibly, like, weighted. Sorry about your tailgate. Oh, that's fine. A little, bit of, a little bit of desync going on on that front, but again, all good. Whoa. Whoa, Tokyo Dorifto gone wrong? Okay. Whoa. Meant to do that. I'm sure you did. Oh, 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 I have all the torque. At least some of the time I have all of the torque. All right. Let me have a look. Right. Oh, oh, we're actually getting very close to one. Very close yep. to one. And I think we should be able to knock out all of the uh, watch points on this map pretty quickly, pretty easily. Just hoping that I don't flip myself over, but that's why I brought Diesel Addict with me. And yeah. this one is right here on the other side of these porta potties. Uh, oh, all right. Scaring the crap out of me right there. Back yeah, up, discovered. And, but it's all good. You're, I mean, Scaring the crap out of me uh, right next to the porta potties. I guess it's fitting. But let's yeah, see. Yeah, that'd do. Hmm. Uh, did you? Bad find... idea coming. Uh, are you? Uh oh. Shortcut. You know there is a perfectly workable bridge over here, right? Like yeah. Perfectly workable bridge. But it seems as though Diesel has decided to take the uh, aquatic approach. Some might say, "What are you doing?" But. You know, I'm just taking the shortcut. What are you doing? <laughs> Irish Potato says, map question mark. And this map is Highway Hauling, which is not on consoles just yet, but hopefully we'll be making his way out there pretty dang soon. All right, Riffs, we will see when you get back. Somebody out there in the chat just got surrendered yesterday. That's amazing. All right, where are you? Okay, you're right there. We've got a dirt road yep. coming up on the left. Boink. Well, I don't think you actually touched me. We got camp to the left and poor to the left. Oh, God, did you see how close I came to oh, yeah, almost he... rolling over? Oh, yeah, you were right up on two tires. Jeez. Yeah, you're right, freaking banana. Like, uh, Diesel does not know what a bridge is. Also, somebody in the chat is very witty and said, water and diesel don't mix. And I'm like, ha-ha, ha-ha. Ooh, diesel float. Yeah, exactly. There you go. All right. Is it? Oh, my jeez. Okay. Um, Is it going to be down at the camp, or is it going to be further down the main road? I'm thinking camp, but I don't know. I think I got this one last time, and it was actually further down this road. Oh, really? Okay, well, I'll tell you what. Yeah. If you go down that road, I'm sure there'll be a task or two in the camp that we can discover. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Okay. Also, uh, banana check DMs. We got creature comforts as a task discovered. I almost flipped her over. And nothing here, which I would assume there would be something here, but there isn't. Now, Actually, there's a road there that leads pretty much directly to the watch point. I got to go through the trees to get it. Oh, well, I guess I'm heading towards it then, or... Yeah, that should work. Whoa. This is actual, like, campground. Oh my god, roleplay opportunities for days. This is a real freaking campground. Bro, this is so cool. Oh my god, camping roleplay incoming. Oh my god. This is gonna be incredible. And yes, Logan, they did. You better believe Wait, they go. did. Got it. You got it? Oh. Heck yeah. Got the wharf hmm, down there, got a lake down here. This is a big old campground, bro. Oh yeah, this is actually really pretty nice. 
It's nice, it's realistic, it's like believable, it feels like a real campground. And let's see, Dawn, if your screen is blurry, make sure you are running the stream in 1080p, 60 FPS, and then you should be good to go. All right. Wow, this climbs up a lot. Are you still up at the top of the campground, or, or did you wait for me somewhere else? Actually, I just started driving back down the hill because I was going to beeline across the river for the other uh, watch point. Oh, you're good. Um, I'm going to actually follow you. And we got a little out there in the chat. What is going on? And Daniel says, any Switch mods, TC? Um, the Switch does not have mods just yet, but um, may or may not be happening in the future. We'll have to wait and see on that one. But, whoa. I will hey, what's say up, Logan? Get... Welcome back. What's up? I will say, if they get mods to work on the Switch, I will be shocked. Yeah, I'll be shocked, too. Uh -huh. Oh, there you are. There you yeah. are. Let's see. Is that truck... Uh, okay console? You mean on console? You better believe it is. It's the Blitzo truck, and you can find it by sorting your mod browser by latest updated, okay? You'll also find a brand new truck on there based on the starting truck from the uh, original Spin Tires game, which is really, really cool. You built up some momentum for that one. I just used my good old 7.3 Torque. <laughs> that good old 7.3 Torque, though. Now, we're gonna be hauling through here with some big trailers a little uh, a little bit later on like we're talking huge god they picked up a few signs you uh you picked up a few things back there i'm not sure what they were but you picked up a few things okay there's one up there i've never actually gotten this map like fully explored are you going okay so you're going down there and Petty 43, what is going on, my dude? And somebody else out there in the chat says, new console mods, question mark. Uh, this truck, for example, is brand new on consoles as of today. And you guys should definitely check it out because this truck is a beast. It's basically a OBS Ford flatbed, and it is on consoles. Not just console friendly, but it is on consoles as of today, PlayStation and Xbox. What is this? Pull that drop off back there in case you're following. Do what? Oh, no, I'm uh, I'm going for a different watch point, actually. A tree tried to eat me. Oh, God. How, I've, like... I literally just touched it with the corner of my bumper, and I nearly went sky high. Jesus. Wow, I'm surprised I was able to make it down that unscathed. I mean, that was completely vertical. Like, I, I know we throw around the term completely vertical, like, a lot, but that was actually completely vertical. All right, found a lumber mill. Uh, I'm gonna see if I can, okay. So that watch point is right there, like directly ahead. Can I go around to the right and get it? Or nope, that's the that's where the map stops. Okay, well we definitely can't do that. Um, let's see, bad tree, exactly. Oscar Schwimmern, what is going on out there in the chat? I see you out there and let's see, oops, out at ah, no worries, but and Slinger, let's see, what are the new console mods, TC? Well, I'm actually driving one of them right now. You can grab this brand new OBS Ford flatbed on consoles literally right now. Um, let's see, do you like jokes, bud? Ah, uh, sometimes. Oh, he just opened another one. Boy, that's legit. And we Got need to build a uh, bridge there. And uh, once again, Tara as well, new console mods, question mark. This thing is available on consoles right now as of today. This is the Blitzo truck, which is a Ford OBS with a flatbed on it. Ray and James and Mr. Lone, welcome back, you guys. And Logan, I know, right? It's freaking wild. Absolutely wild. Freaking nuts, bro. Oh, I remember this bridge, I think. When I did my initial exploration video on this map, I found this bridge. And we're going to see if we can... Oh, oh, okay. That's not the last watch point, is there? Or is that? Um, there's two more left, I think. No, I think I'm that's the last the... one. No, I'm looking at two on the map. I have them both marked. Oh no, you're good. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. There's one up there. Oh, oh. what? The... What the heck? Uh, that wasn't me. Wasn't me either. Connection with the host was lost. Oh wow, it said connection lost. Online features are not available. Uh -oh. Whoa! Whoa! Oh my god! That is like... That is ridiculous. Um, I didn't know about... Um, I didn't know about, like... Any maintenance happening today. I wonder if that was a uh, hiccup or if that's maintenance. I'm gonna guess that's a hiccup because I didn't see anything 
on like Facebook or anything like that? Or yeah, or Discord? Discord or anything. So yeah. I'm going to try to reload that. I hope it didn't completely demolish our like progress. That's so weird. Let's see. Epic Server said, no, no. <laughs> Welcome to TC Breaks His PC. Yeah. Let's see. Actually, a bunch of people out there in the chat are saying like, oh my God, that happens to me all the time. Or, oh my God, that keeps happening to me. And like, you know what? I'm not surprised. Uh, I'm not like, all right. So let's see. Lime's at 450. Blitzo. All that good stuff. Since my Brigadier 8000 is right here at the garage, I'm going to go ahead and rescue it back into the garage. And um, and then I will retain it and use it as my multiplayer, like, re-entry truck. You know what I mean? Yeah. Let's and see. Oscar with... says it would have put you back by exactly 30 minutes. How? How? That doesn't make any sense. Why would it have put me back by 30 um... minutes exactly? That doesn't make any sense. I mean... Better question is, how would he know exactly how many t minutes it would put you back? That's uh, so weird. Zachary, what is up? I see you saying hi. And Ecliptic YT, the servers need a bit of coding done to fix it up. Yeah, they, they, um, I think I'm going to give it like this one chance. But also like if I, if I try to get back in and the game is just like, no, then we might have found a bug. Like I have absolutely no idea, but we'll see when it crashes, it, he said, when it when it crashes, it puts you back 30 minutes, no matter what. I'm like, what? Oh, I get what he means. It puts you back 30 minutes in the game time. So it's oh! 30 minutes earlier. Oh, I thought he meant like 30 minutes, like real world time. Oh, okay. Is the RD on consoles? Not yet, my dude. Okay, so it won't actually load me into multiplayer right now. So um, I'm going to actually do a very, very, very quick swift restarty boy. And... That should be very simple. Very simple. Don't worry, guys. Um, I see you out there in the chat. Like, some of you guys are, are uh, you know, uh, freaking out a little bit. It's going to be fine. But let's see real quick. I know that it's just my uh, it's just my face you see at the moment, but that is fine. We're going to get that all figured out. No worries at all. So, back into my epic library. Back into SnowRunner public test server. We are loading up. All is good. Uh, it's a bug. I wonder also, Diesel, if it's one of those things where it's like... If the game crashes out of multiplayer, you can't reload back into it until it, uh, like, until you restart it. Like, once it actually crashes out, it's like, it sort of, like, ruins the multiplayer connectivity until you completely reboot the game. But that's actually never... Yeah, that never, sounds about right. That's never happened to me before. So odd. All right, I'm going to load into my... Whoa, whoa! All right, we're good now. Load game. It actually flashed a weird message at me, and it said, um, it said, like, connection issue to mod.io, and I was like, uh-oh. Yep, that's been happening on and off for a while. Uh-oh, but now it's good. It only flashed it at me. Like, it, 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 it's good. It's good, it's good, it's good. Uh, CJ, ah, don't worry about it. It's gonna be fine. Let's see, I'm looking for a good map that has a lot of money. Any suggestions And I'm on console? Any map by Limes. Yeah, any map by Limes. You can also go ahead and download the free DLC trucks. And then once you download those, you can actually, um... You can actually, like, save them, if, uh, if that makes any sense. Like, you can, um... You can retain them and then sell them for in-game money. So... All good, and then I've retained my Ford 9000. I'm going back to the main menu, and I'm going to try to load into a multiplayer instance again. So, co-op. Oh, no. Waiting uh -oh. while permissions being checked. Uh, that's what happened with me. Every other time we would try and join, like, last week, that was what was going on. That's so weird, though. But the thing is, it doesn't give me any option to get out of it. And now the game crashed. The game completely crashed on the checking permission screen. Oh my God. Okay. All right, SnowRunner. You want to play this way? I, I, wow. Wow. Path manager and oh! end the SnowRunner. Holy oh! cow. Oh. I'm. Oh my god! Hot shot dropping the $200 super chat! ATC just wanted to see how you were doing. Finally got a day off. 
to catch one of your streams. <gasps> and it's a legit one. It registered. <laughs> and hot shots back. Oh my God. I went to like take my headset off because I'm like freaking out. But then I realized that you were in my headset. So, <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh! Help. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh my god. Oh. oh my. Oh my god. Oh my god. All right. Oh, let me. Oh, thank you so much. Oh my god. Let me check this one more time. Wait a minute. It lets me start without checking permissions. Okay. Hold on. We'll wait. Let me load into single player to make I, make sure I have a retained truck. Then I'm good to go. DeBoss98 is like, TC right now be like, endless loading symbol. Yeah? <laughs> oh my god. Well, I guess that means I have to shave my beard again. I guess that means I have to shave my beard again. No! Oh my god. Ah! Oh my god. Okay, yeah. Nope. It, banana is like, breathe, boy. Yeah, I'll tell you. It's gonna be... Oh, if Hotshot does that again, I'm gonna need myself a good old oxygen tank, I think. <laughs> I'm like, dude, I'm going to be here on, like, a diving setup with, like, a diving mask and direct feed oxygen if he does that again. <laughs> I can barely breathe as it is. Wow. Whew. All right. Truck mods on. Start co-op. Searching. 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 Please. Cr oh, my God. All right. Highway hauling. Loading up in multiplayer. Let's see. Wait, camouflage, you read my, wait, you put, oh, oh, yeah, no, ecliptic, I saw it, it's hilarious, DeBoss98 says, not the beard, no, <laughs> let's see, now that's, now that that's out of the way, is there any new console mods, yes, so there is a brand new OBS Ford flatbed on consoles called the Blitzo truck, and Eric says, where is the Ford, all you gotta do is go into, uh, your mod browser and sort by latest updates, alright, so I am now back in, and apparently now it's morning time. Um, the, the night just did not exist, but I'm okay with that. Um, yep, and I'm Diesel fine. made it in. Oh, dude, I'm so happy! Oh my god! Thank you guys so freaking much, bro. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Cooper McCoy, what is going on out there in the chat as I understeer to directly towards a road sign? But let me uh, get within range of these... Uh, watchtowers, and we'll knock these two more out for diesel, and then we will begin our highway hauling. Our highway hauling slash heavy hauling slash just having a good time with big old trucks. But remember to check out this brand new um, OBS Ford flatbed on consoles called the Blitzo truck. Now, there is a trail up here on the left that I'm going to go ahead and take real quick. Oh my god. Dude, this is a mud trail. Like, this is just like... The ground up here is so incredibly saturated. Holy smokes. By the way, you guys, this truck, once again, for those of you asking about the latest console mods, today it is this truck right here, this flatbed OBS Ford, which is available today on consoles, as well as a remake of the old blue truck from the original spin tires available on consoles as well. Both are able to be found by using the... Wow, okay, uh, apparently I'm fine. Um... Both of them are able to be found by sorting your mod browser by latest updates, bros. All right, we're about to pick up this last watch point here. Or, well, not last watch point, but second to last watch point here on highway hauling. Getting close, getting close, getting close. Probably going to take this upcoming right-hand turn, and that should put us exactly where we need to be. Oh, boy. Yeah, this map doesn't have necessarily, like, uh, can you show the interior? Yes. The wheel doesn't move, but it's got some cool features to it. Um, this map is not all, like, heavy hauling. There are a couple of trails, but it's not necessarily, like, the craziest trail system. But that's fine, because you're really just trying to find, um, a couple of trails here and there. Also, Diesel, maybe later today we can also try out Dub's new trail map. 
Oh yeah, that sounds good. I did manage to get it downloaded the other day. Okay. Let's... Also, ignore the fact that there's a drifting brigadier with a flatbed. Ah, don't worry about it. Um, uh, oh my god, Banana said that, um, he wants to see a, um, like a gooseneck, you know, toy hauler slash RV trailer pack, and my god would I love to see that. That would be so cool. Um, and he also said that if someone made, ooh, well we just, oh, that's so beautiful! But yeah, he was like, if someone came out with a, uh, a pack of console-friendly Jeeps, they should just call them Beeps, which, to be fair, I think that would be a great replacement. God! Hot shot again with $150 super chat. Here's another for you, TC. Woo! <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh my god, dude! Woo! <laughs> and you guys blew through 400 likes on the stream right at the same time! My voice doesn't exist right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh! God! Oh my god! Jesus, dude! Wow! Wow! You make me like lose my freaking mind! Holy smokes! Go! Oh my god, this is literally like. Oh, this is breaking me! Oh, but I love it. Thank you so much! For all of your incredible support, dude. Uh, jeez. I, I don't even like... <sighs> oh, I don't even know what to say, bro. Thank you so much. Your support is insanity. Wow. Okay. Making my run to the final watch point now. Let's see what we can find. And... Ah, right, Banana, what's up? Hey, Kazuki SU, what is going on, my dude? Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's see. Oh my god. Atlanta MX3 is like, well, now you have to name your firstborn after Hotshot, I guess. Oh boy. Oh. Diesel. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Are you I... in trouble? No, but I may have made a slight accidental detour. Uh, hey, hey, hmm. hey. There we go. This Blitzo is a little bit like... Now, I am running the tow suspension on it, which probably isn't the best for this scenario, but, um, because it kind of bounces around a bit. But I figured I was going to be having to, like, do work with it. Oh, no. Oh, only the quick winch works right now. Oh, that's great. Ah, oh. GPS things. Here we go. Don't you even dare. Uh-uh. Oh, I got a tree, like, encased within my cab. Okay, not a trailer pack, but an actual RV to do camping roleplay with. I'd be down for an actual, like, RV. That'd be so sick. You remember the off-road RVs from, uh, from Mudrunner? Those were so much fun. Ha-ha! I am moderately heading the right way. Uh-oh. Is this mod on console? You better believe it is, Ark. Uh-huh. This is a, uh, a mod by Limes called the Blitzo Truck, and it is a fully console-approved uh, Ford OBS with a flatbed. I almost said console-friendly, but it's been approved now, so, like, I mean, it's on consoles. You need a roll cage. Ha 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 ha. Yeah. Uh, that truck isn't the best for hill climbing. Yeah, we're, we're finding that out. Easy, easy, easy. Oh, we try to keep them, uh... We try to keep him pretty friendly, Ecliptic, yeah. But I should be heading to the very last watch point right now. And, Diesel, you should be good to go. I, I, I'm, I'm sure you've already hooked up your trailer. Whoa! There's Actually, a... I have a full load of food from the farm. Oh, I just you can't really? remember where to take it. Oh, God. Yeah, um, I, I see a logging trailer, like, down in a pond. And, let's hmm. see... Oh, Drew Dog says I'm driving the new Ford OBS on summer proving grounds in stock form. 250 horsepower in this truck will go anywhere. I love it. Dude, it's freaking awesome. I have mine in, I think, 500 horse right now. Yeah, the 500 horse tune is like nuts. Absolutely wild. Wait, did I? Oh, oh, I see. So I went to a log site, which is fine, but I can actually, like, the woods is pretty thinned out. 
So, hey, yeah, no worries, Ecliptic, no worries. I appreciate you asking and bringing it up. Let's see, there's that caravan pack from Pog that has campers. That's true, but uh, I think Banana was talking about, like, legit, like, drivable RVs, which would be so insane. Oh, 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 right. oh, oh. Contracts. Oh. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. It's like, oh, my God. Back to that SpongeBob seat. You're good. You're good. You're good. Yeah. And boom, there it is. All right, this let's see. This is that awkward moment when you realize you can't activate tasks because you're not the host. <laughs> Bruh, okay. All right, well, Oof. I'm recovering now because of the simple fact that... Um, hey, what's up, Jermaine Reed? I see you out there in the chat. Let's see. Uh, if you donate to get will you shave your beard on stream? I don't know if I'll shave it on stream, but I might film it to some degree. But um, let's see. Do they fix the money problem? Uh, so that is something that individual map creators have to update on their own. But once they update it, it'll be fine. Now... I am now out of the garage, and yeet. All right, I'm going to shut this guy down. Swap over to Lonzo 450. This thing is silly. God, it's so silly. He's working on a console-friendly version of this. Gavin and DX, what is going on? And uh, Puppet Master IX Winnebago. Oh, bruh, if you did IX Winnebago, uh, please. Please. Okay, so I believe... Oh, no, there's that one have... last one. It would have to be IX Quad Steer style, though. Wait, where's the last one? Literally right in front of our faces. <laughs> what okay, that? I'll get that. I'll get that one. Yeah, all right. Yeah, you just, like, literally blast up there. I'm going to see what we have to do for scrap dealing. Okay, sounds good. Been doing really well, uh, Jermaine Reed. How about you, man? Let's see. Ooh. Hey, look, there's a staircase over here. Where? Right here. Oh, About to oh. drive up it. Oh, oh, I've seen that one. Yeah. Oh, I didn't realize I was in high mode with the tow suspension. This thing okay, just so I can't drive up it. This thing just needs some freaking holy fenders. Somebody said get a huge trailer, and I'm like, oh, don't you worry. On the list, bruh. On the list. All right. So, dude, oh, my God. All right. So... I am very, very, very excited to do scrap dealing because we have to recover four different vehicles. A Tega, a P-16, an International Scout, and a Cat 745C. It's going to be involved as heck. So, but... but I record time. Yeah, I was going to say, we get a new location um, out of the deep. So, huh. like, well, not a new location, but we get a, um, like, a factory uh, pickup area out of the deal. Tega right there. And... Come on. Okay, so all the trucks are fairly nearby. Some of them are out by the logging area, and then the other one... Oh! That's that Scout 800 that's right by the house that you have to recover. Oh, that's so cool! That's actually really cool. Like, I, I, I appreciate the fact that he made use of that. I really appreciate the fact that he made use of that. I really do. All right, I'm gonna get myself a trailer. This is such a good looking map. Dude, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. Wait until you find out what he has in the plans for the future. Mm. I mean. Fascinating. All right, we ready. I'm gonna go get the, let's see, which ones do you want? Cause, uh, I'll take the P16. Because I'm going for the Scout first. Okay, actually, I'll take the P16 and the Cat. Okay, yeah, that's fair. I'll go for the Scout and I'll go for the Tega. Um, the Tega's really, really close. And so what I'll do is I'll just get the Tega first. And then I'll grab the um, I'll grab the, uh, the Scout after the fact. But let's see. Whoa. I don't know about that, normal dude. He's been around for a while. Let's see, these on console right now. So the one that's on console right now 
is this thing. This is the Blitzo truck by Limes. It is a OBS Ford flatbed that is available on consoles as of today. There's also a old school uh, original spin tires truck that has been modified and updated to be available on consoles as well. But this will be available on your mod browser on PlayStation and Xbox. Same as that old school spin tires truck. And this truck right here is console, well, has a console friendly version in development and should be, uh, should be getting pushed to consoles in the future once the console friendly version is complete. Whoa! Closing in on that Tega. You putting together a, uh, a 3880, a heavy wrecker? I had to. I bet. Hmm. All right, how am I gonna get my big old trailer out into that field? Um, actually, there seems like an entry point. So, sub, run the gamer. I see you out there, and let's see, Eagle or uh, sorry, Kegel. I see you out there, and Brian Walker. What is going on? Go Tokyo drifting. Ah, this thing does it on its own. I don't even have to worry about it. All right, up the beaten path. Let's go. Okay, so take a recovery time. We're gonna back it in, and it won't be too bad. Will the TRX4 make an appearance? Oh, I don't have one yet, but maybe in the future, dude. Let's see. Have a fan and Gavin Farms. What is going on, my dudes out there in the chat? I see ya. Oh, there we go. All right, backing her up. All right, I've gotten it to spawn in. Well, not spawn in, but like, you know, activate Loaded. its physics. Also, if you see a uh, road sign in the air somewhere, that wasn't me. Uh, okay. So... Oh, this is gonna work. Oh my god, I'm legit, like, actually using a trailer winch the way you're supposed to. Oh, this is so cool. <laughs> oh... This is so cool. All right. So she'll be good to go right there. Pack trucks. I, I brought it a little bit too close, admittedly, but not too worried about it. Oh, man. That thing is broken as heck. Like, tires are flat. Suspension's broken. Holy moly. So let me so, see. Uh I had nothing to do with that. I don't know how I got down here. What do you no mean? <laughs> Pay no attention. You saw nothing. Pay no attention. You saw nothing. Move on with your lives, citizens. <laughs> yes, exactly. Dude, this Tega is beat up. Like, it is so beat up. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. I'm just like hmm. slightly wildly making my way downtown, but it's okay. Knock it over that roadside. That one was my fault. So uh, if you see one knocked over over here, that was me. Is this thing actually packed still? Or is it? Yeah, no, it's packed. It's just um, the flat tires are covering up, um, like covering up the freaking uh, uh, wheel chops. And. Whoa, Nicholas, what is going on, my dude? I see you out there in the chat. I love doing these vehicle recovery missions. They are so much fun, especially with, like, a built truck like this F-450. God, it's so good for it. I wonder if he plans to have this bridge be a completable task, because right now, I am. There is no way I'm getting past this. You are a bit, uh, as they would say, oot of luck in, uh, in Canada. <laughs> a little bit. So, plan B. Uh, plan B. Send it! Exactly. Let's see. Uh, Boat says, do you still have your Dodge Ram in real life? I do not, but there is a plan for a real-world truck to be coming to the channel uh, maybe a little bit sooner than you might expect, so make sure you stay tuned for that. Just got to finalize a couple of things, and whoa! I'm going to just knock over this fence. I don't think they'll mind. Yeah, he'd probably be on the fence about it anyway. Yeah. All right, so... Exactly. 
Now let's see. How am I gonna get that guy off of the, uh, the trailer? I didn't think that far ahead. All right, I'm gonna have to pull it off. Like legit, hmm. I'm going to have to pull it off with my truck. I'm gonna have to back up to the other side and like pull it off. I did not think that far ahead, but that's okay. But I mean, as you can see, it like the Tega has been checked off the list, so we're good there. It's just kind of like a matter of getting it to where it needs to be. So exactly. You're gonna come with me. Yeet. And the leap. Yeah, yeet and delete, pretty much. And since it doesn't need to remain in that, like, warehouse area... By the way, guys, thank you so much for blowing through that 450 likes mark on the stream. Truck go yeet. Yeah, pretty much. Let's see. Is all this in basic game on PC? Uh, pretty much. Pretty much. Whoop. And if not, the mods are all, except for a few, public. Yeah, except for a couple are public. And then the Blitzo truck, which is a OBS Ford, is now fully available on consoles. And I'll show that again to you guys in just a second after I hook my trailer back up. I'm going to be fine. Don't worry about it. There we go. Love the 3880. Dude, it's so good. It and can like, go anywhere. Anywhere that it wants. All right, we're good to go there with the trailer. Or anywhere that Psycho Drivers pointing out fingers. Me. Exactly. We'll put it. All right. Knocked over those fences for, I don't know, easier access. At least you're not on the fence about it. Nope. Certainly ain't on the fence about that. What's up, Jen? I see you out there in the chat. And yeet, yeet, skirt. Yeah, pretty much. That's kind of like how it goes in our, uh, our lobbies. It's like yeet, yeet, followed by a skirt or two. You know, no big deal. <laughs> All right, so now I'm gonna go get mm. that scout, and I don't need a big wide trailer for the scout, so I'm gonna put like less stress on the F450 by selling this trailer, and I'm gonna buy a smaller one. And let's see, there we go. Woohoo! Well, woo this is the, uh, this is quite the gap here. Yeah, quite the yeet, right? Tristan and under what is going on you guys and this map is not on console yet but hopefully soon also guys if you are interested in joining the discord and hanging out or checking out maybe some of our shirts or anything like that make sure you check out the link that puppy master just threw out there in the chat all right so i'm gonna actually repair my truck and i'm going to now exit the garage and go back to the trailer store and ooh, actually though hmm i might go for a slightly different wheel and tire package Slightly different, not super different, but um, I might go with the Nittos this time. And did he add any other wheels for those? Just the forked ones. Okay. Yeah, we're good on those. And then now, since we're not doing... Um, yeah, I know it does need the dually fenders for sure. But now, since we're not doing a, like, uh, a haul that requires us to have, you know, tons of load-bearing capacity in the back, um, that's why I've decided to switch over from duallys to a SRW setup. And I'm gonna grab the short gooseneck and head out to grab the International Scout, which shouldn't be uh, that bad at all. It should be pretty simple. All right, let me go ahead and spin it around in here. Go oh, right up onto two wheels. This short gooseneck should be a heck of a lot more maneuverable as well. This will go perfectly with that uh, with that International Scout. I'm actually go. gonna put the suspension down. Oh, what the heck? I meant to put the suspension down. There you go. Now it's a lot more level. These lights are so freaking bright. Is that a 2020 Silverado on the thumbnail? Heck yeah, it is outlaw. And that thing is fully uh, unbranded, console friendly. And it's, it hasn't been approved yet, obviously, but it's been submitted for testing. And so all we got to do is wait and see. All we got to do is wait and see, my dude. We got a little bit of a uh, highway trek ahead of us because we gotta go pick up an international scout that has been broken and abandoned, basically. And uh, once we get down to where it is, we should be all good to go. This thing has some weird, like, sound glitches, but, oh, you joined the Discord? That's awesome, Allison. But uh, yeah, let's see. I did not, Casey, but I'll keep an eye out for it just in case. Yeah, I didn't see it, but I'll, uh, I'll definitely be on the lookout. So as the sun goes down, you guys will see how incredibly bright the lights on this F450 actually are. They're so freaking bright. 
drift runner. Yeah, pretty much on a map like this. Trailer is passing me. I do like how on the uh, on the IR goose next, um, and you probably knew this, Diesel, but if you hit the handbrake, it also activates the trailer brakes. That I didn't know, actually. So if you're in like a sketchy situation, um, you can you can just grab the e-brake real quick and um, and kind of help save your whole setup by activating the trailer brakes. There we go. So let's see where we're headed. Okay, so. I need to go... Oh! I see where I need to go. Actually, I can just head straight down the highway. I mean, I'm going to go through somebody's field, but I ain't going to worry about it. I'll be fielding questions later. Yeah, that's fine. Don't worry. This is all good. Remington Drake, what is good out there in the chat? I see you checking in and saying hi. Whoop. It is even like one of those maps where even when the sun goes down, it still remains really beautiful. And that's something that a lot of maps struggle to do. At least in yeah, my opinion. Like a map that even keeps the vanilla me map too. Yeah, a map that keeps me engaged at night is pretty rare because even in the vanilla maps, I usually always just skip through it, at least if I'm not playing a multiplayer, you know what I mean? Yeah. All right, I'm gonna head down the edge of this cornfield. A little bit of damage, but not gonna worry about it too much. As long as you go slow through these cornfields, you won't damage yourself. So you're you're good to go through there. It's just it's easy. Lynn, what is going out there in the chat? I see you checking in. Thank you for saying hi. All right, there's the scout. What is the best way to get in there? Can I get behind? The bar. Yes, I can. Okay, that's definitely going to be the best way to do it. I'm going to have to do this in the dark, too. All right, rip your fence, bro. Sorry. R.I.P. your fence and your pumpkins. Uh, let's see. Pinky, what is going on out there in the chat? And let's see. John, any mods on PS4? You better believe it, man. There is a console-friendly Ford OBS that has dropped on Xbox and PlayStation as of today. That could have gone a whole lot better. That could have gone a lot better. Oh, God. What happened? Uh, rollback things. Uh-oh. See, it's reasons like this that I always t tend to eat the uh, the different stuck vehicles that need recovery. Oh, yeah? Because right now I'm trying to load a Cat 745C on the back of the 3880. Why do I feel like that's a little too big for that? Just, just a little. Nah, it'll fit. I'll fit. Seriously, it'll, it will actually. About it. it actually will fit. Mm -hmm. The problem is, it's got six flat tires, so. Yeah, yeah, that's hard to deal with. Hmm. So I've come up with a strategy, or at least I think I have. I just yeah. See, but banana has it. What it did always he say? fits. It. Oh. It always fits if it's me driving. Exactly. I'm going to have to push my trailer just a little bit out of the way. I don't want to push it too much, but just enough. Because I'm going to need to, with the Scout, the Scout is weird. Because I'm going to need to drag it onto the trailer and just kind of encourage it to get up there. Um, yeah. Also, the cat may or may not now be on its side. Oh my god. All right, are you gonna be able to come with me? It so worked! Word of, word of advice, don't bring a trailer this way because there is a gap here that even the 3880 struggled to get around. Oh, really? Oh, geez. Yeah. Hold on. Actually, you know, maybe I shouldn't try and drag it reverse end first or back end first onto the rollback. I should probably put a point up, if you will. Eh, probably. Whoa! Let's see. You're paying for the corn, my fence, and those pumpkins. Sorry. I didn't realize you were the landowner, bud. <laughs> All my job description said was to get this broken down scout off his property 
by any means necessary, which is what I'm in the process of doing, definitely. All right, so... I'm gonna try and winch that scout the rest of the way up. Oh, jeez. Oh, this is what I was worried about. Oh, no! Oh, I hate that! God! Let's see. Oh, my God. No! No! Okay. Well, by the way, what is up, Banana? I'm just doing a check real quick. Uh, let's see. Well, I'm going to be able to check that a little bit later. But, um, but yeah, just let me know if anything happens in the chat, of course. But, John, what's going on out there in the chat, my dude? And Dwight Sparks, hey, man, I finally made it into one of your streams. Thank you so much, bro. I really appreciate it. Okay. Um, how am I going to make this work? <laughs> I'm going to, like... I know I'm fumbling my way through this right now, but I will get that uh, scout on the trailer. It's just, like, the small tire vehicles are just so picky. You know what I mean? Yeah. They're so picky with how they get loaded, um, how they work, how you drive them. And I don't know why that is, but they're just like, I almost feel like all of the small tire vehicles in the game are just like, they are unnecessarily um, like floppy. You know what I mean? Yeah, they're just really hard to work with. They're, and, and everything is like, the suspensions are like ultra rigid. Like, they don't have to be that stiff. And I don't know if that, like I said before, was a conscious decision or more of a byproduct of the physics system or if they just kind of said, um, hey, like, this looks right. You know, like, I, if they were, if they drove it and they were like, yep, looks good to me, boss. Like, I don't know. I mean. Yeah, I'm going to vote it was something like that. If I'm which, honest. Which they could have done. And I'm not saying that's bad. I'm just saying that I, I don't know if, I don't know if that's how I would program it, for sure. Yeah. Alright. Now I've got the scout where I want it. And I'm gonna have the absolute worst job of getting this thing turned around! Alright, let's see. What are all the new mods? Once again, the latest console mod that you guys... Oh, look at that beautiful sky, by the way. That night sky is gorgeous. But the latest mod that you guys definitely need to check out on consoles is this right here. The Blitzo Truck, which is a console-friendly uh, Ford OBS, which is, once again, fully available on consoles as of today. By the way, you guys are about to blow through that 500 likes mark on the stream already. That is wild. So I will revisit putting the cat on the 3880 at a later date. Huh? Oh, my God. What's your new strat? Well, the new strat is to go and pick up the P16. Aha! Uh -huh. up here on the hill, because I know that'll fit. Yeah. Let's see. And Hip just... says, would you recommend this game? Hey, you guys already blew through that fucking likes mark. Thank you so much. But um, once again, uh, someone on the, uh, in the chat said, would you recommend this game to people that bought Mudrunner? I would. You know, I mean, I know it's got its quirks. I know it's got its flaws, but it's still a dang good game. And it also still offers an experience you're not going to find anywhere else, you know? Yeah. And the other thing I would say is if you're considering console Mudrunner or if you had Mudrunner on console, definitely pick up SnowRunner. It's just because way you have it, it's... You have more trucks, you have more options to do things to the trucks, you can change paint schemes, lift kits, engines, and now you even have mods. Yeah, and there's there's really none of those that I would say, like, people aren't gonna want. You know what I mean? Exactly. I still see people to this day asking, how do I get mods on MudRunner on Xbox? Yeah. Okay, so there's the broken down P16. No! Sorry, that was a bit pronounced, I know. Um, hang on. Now, how in the world? Since this is like an RP map, Remo, I have to ask, how in the world somebody got a P16 up there <laughs> and broke it down? I know, exactly, right? Like... Yeah. I mean, have you seen where this thing is? Uh, I looked at it on the map. It looks like it's on a logging road, but that's kind of all I know. You know what I mean? And the 3880 is doing a barrel roll. I mean, is it actually on a logging road, or is it on something a little different? It's on a hill. Oh, Jesus. And as you may have guessed, I am now on my side. 
There we go. I Problem hate solved. this scout. Oh my god, I despise this scout task. Oh my... Getting it on a trailer is the most ridiculous thing. Actually, new plan. You know what? I'm setting off. Like, Scout, you're gonna stay there. Like, off we go. Off we go, you're coming with me. I'm just gonna use the freaking winch to keep you there. I'm not gonna worry about packing you. I'm not gonna worry about what you might scrape or dent or damage. Let's see. Just Yeet is behind you, TC. What? All right, off we go then. This guy is going straight back out to the cornfields, and I have no remorse for that scout now at this point. What, everything that it's put us through is like, also, by the way, gorgeous rock light work. Loving it, loving it, loving it. P16 is pulling the 3880 towards it. Bruh. Hold there on. There we go. As soon as I, I mean, I'll be back there to help you. I know I'm on the wrong side of the highway, but once I drop this scout off, I will literally be there to help you. Like, okay. I see you oh, on. on the struggle bus for sure. Let's see. Stop trying to use the trailer and just use the diesel method. Now, that's pretty much what I'm doing right now. And let's see. You need to stop rolling. Just disconnect the winch. It doesn't always work that way. Let's see. One of the new mods. Question, 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 mark. Um, the newest mods are, I know, like I said before, I'm driving on the wrong side of the highway. But at this point, I don't really care. I just want this dropped off. But um, the latest console mods are the Blitzo truck by Limes, which is a flatbed Ford. Uh, it's a flatbed OBS Ford that I definitely recommend picking up, as well as a mod by Ranger, which is a old school Spin Tires original truck that you guys definitely need to check out if you remember the original blue truck from Spin Tires uh, that you would pick up like right at the beginning of the game. It's that thing. Yeah, that those trailer brakes really help prevent this thing from swaying. Oh god, it still wants to sway on me bad though. Like real bad. Holy moly, dudes. Thank so, you guys once again up. for blowing through that 500 likes mark on the stream. Freaking huge, y'all. What were you saying, Diesel? Sit rep, the P16 is now back on all six wheels, don't ask. Oh and boy. It's it's about to go, hopefully, on the rollback. Yes. Yes. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and make a quick left. I'm gonna get this uh, this scout dropped off, and then I will be available for assistance for a uh, an assisty boy. Let's see, you can put the frog side by side on the flatbed on the blitzo. Heck yeah, you can, Phantom's Ghost. You better freaking believe you can. It works great for transporting frogs side by side. Actually, it's great for that. Oh god. Oh oh. Okay. Well. Actually, it's in a better position on the trailer now than it was before. Don't worry about it. Uh, TC's delivery service is on the job. TC hauling. It's fine. That's literally the company slogan. It's fine. We done, boys, with that one. All right, Scout's here. And now I'm going to go sell this trailer real quick. And then I'm going to go do Diesel Attic to heck and assist. Because he needs it. Also, like, did the devs, I don't know, Diesel, if you ever saw or not, but did the devs ever clarify why they couldn't do um, trailer deleting in multiplayer? Uh, I honestly never bothered to look. Okay. I just figured it was a coding problem that they may have tried. Yeah, I'm sure they then... tried it, but... It may even be something that's coming in a later update. I really yeah. don't know. Because it was something that they made like a big deal about doing, and then all of a sudden they were like, uh, heck no. And I was like, oh, I thought we were, I was like, I thought we were doing this, but I guess not. Um, but let's see. We got, let's see. Uh, hey, TC, I have the same truck and setup the diesel is using. That's awesome, Otis Jr. That's legit. The 3880 is awesome. So the Blitzo truck, once again, is one of the latest console mods that you guys can use. And that flatbed can totally 100% pack uh, frogs side by side. So I definitely recommend picking this thing up if you like realistic trucks, older Fords, uh, or anything that can haul a side by side, really. <sighs> Needed some of that uh, stream hydration there. Okay, you know what? We're just you know going to do what? this the easy way. All yeah, right. we're doing this. We're doing this the easy way. We're doing this the diesel way. <laughs> yeah, this, there you go. It's stuck on my. 
let's see. And let's see, I did an entire map with the forward. It wasn't ma it wasn't bad. Yeah, no, this thing's really good. Um, once again, you guys should definitely check this thing out on consoles. It's a really fun truck, and it's fully available as of today, along with that original um blue truck from the uh from the old spin tires games. By the way, um somebody said, How did you get that thing to work with um the what is the oh god, what's the other gooseneck pack? Oh, what's the other gooseneck pack? With the Delta? Yeah, and that wasn't the Delta Gooseneck pack. That was actually the um, uh, uh, the Red Gooseneck pack. Now, I might actually come and help you in the new uh, 2020 Silverado Dually, which this thing is, like, this thing is monstrous. Let's see, KJ and Ricardo, what is going on out there, boys? I see you guys out there in the chat. I love this new Silverado. This thing is so good. Working gauges and all, it's an absolute beast. Full interior. Fully console friendly, unbranded. This thing I am genuinely hoping will make its way to consoles pretty soon. So, where are you at? He is... Oh. Okay, well, let's see. An entire map with a CLT 9000. Boy! Boy, oh boy. August, what is going on out there in the chat? My, my dude, I see ya. Alright, I am... Very swiftly advancing in the uh, 2020 Silverado. Good old Silverado. This poor P16 is going to hate life by the time I'm done with it. Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, it's funny because I feel like right off the bat you were like, oh, yeah, I'll take the, um, oh, man, Formula Drift. All right. Uh, but, no, you're like, I'll take the heavy-duty ones. They'll be a piece of cake for the 3880. And, like, you know, two truck deliveries later, and you're like, I am struggling. Yeah, it would have been fine if I hadn't decided to get picky and roleplay y. Yeah. Roleplay ish, yeah. TC's delivery service is on his way. Uh, more like I'm just on my way to provide an assist to Diesel. That's all. Nolan, what is going on out there in the chat? Thank you so much for stopping by. And Lennox says, I am doing a mission on Serena right now as we speak. Heck yeah, dude. I am sliding all over the place in this thing on the road, which to be fair is very, very fun and it drifts amazingly well, but like. I don't know. It's it's like a little all over the place though when you start getting up in speed for sure. I'm gonna say there's no way that P16 is gonna get stuck now. Oh god, I don't know what you've done, but I hope it's something effective. All it right. is. I'm at the edge of that bridge right now, and so you're going down. All right, let me see what I can help with. I'm gonna head down this edge right here i know i'm predominantly a hauling truck slash street truck but i can do it bethany harrison what is going on my dude welcome back oh my god steak he's like oh come on diesel i could do it with the western star and i'm like uh-huh uh-huh okay okay steak that's how we're playing huh yeah yeah exactly i wonder if i could storm through this river i should have brought the ford well, actually, you can't actually go through the river, no problem. 3880 cleared it. Okay, yeah, I'm just gonna do that then. Yeet, yeet. Okay. Wow, that is not all that deep. I, my, like, the tops of my stacks were still above the water. Okay. Yeah. You become a submarine in the smaller vehicles. But honestly, it's not that bad. I mean, brand new Duramax Dually inbound for assistance. Alright, I'm going back to hopefully help with that uh, 745C, because that's a beast. Actually, I may go back and get the 745C and let you pull the P16. Okay, I mean, I can do either uh, either or. Zide, what is going on, my dude, out there in the chat? We need a transfer tank in that thing? That'd be freaking awesome, Chevy Thompson. That'd be so legit. All right, I see you coming in, I think. Yeah, I see your lights coming my way, and now All I see right. stacks. Making my way downtown. <laughs> okay. Well, there it is back there. Your hood's open again. Your hood's open again. Your hood's open again. <laughs> and uh, once again, you guys that are asking about the latest console mods, uh, the latest one that I definitely recommend is the Blitzo truck, which we have in this game session. We've been using it from time to time. It is a fully console-friendly uh, Ford OBS with a flatbed that can haul frogs side by side. So I definitely recommend giving it a shot and picking it up. Uh, you will not be disappointed by that truck. 
So I'm going to pull this thing from the rear because I feel like it's probably a little bit better that way. And Wayne Taylor with the 299 Super Chat. DC, is Delta Trailer Pack or Red's Trailer Pack better? First of all, thank you so much for that 299 Super Chat. And honestly, there really isn't one that's better than the other. They both suit different vehicles and different approaches. And really, at the end of the day, it's all down to your personal preference. But once again, thank you so much for that 299 Super Chat, Wayne. I really appreciate it. Thank you for supporting the channel. All right, we're going to the back of that uh, P-16. And uh, we are going to haul. Oh, God. Or maybe not. Maybe we're not going to haul. Um, Does that thing have the parking brake on? I can't move it. That's shocking to me. I can't move it. Like, legitimately, I cannot move it. Wow. Dude, I, I legitimately cannot freaking move this thing. This is like... This is nuts. Oh. Oh. Okay, yeah, no. No, I'm getting the Ford. I, I yeah, have I'll no... Be... Like... No, you don't have to come get this thing. You're doing the 745C. But, like, I am getting the Ford. And I am going for bulletproof engine... Uh, tow transmission, tow setup suspension, and uh, swamper duels because I I ain't holding back. I'm I'm not interested in holding back. This with the full rock light setup, by the way, is what we are going to be using to bring that thing back in. DX World, what is going on? And what are these mods or are these mods out right now? So the one that just came out is this one right here. It is a Ford OBS on the console mod browser. It is a uh, flatbed with a bunch of suspension options, engine options, and tire options that I highly recommend checking out as soon as you get the chance. There's also a original uh, spin tires inspired truck, basically. Uh, remember that old blue, um, kind of like basic hauling truck from the original spin tires? There's a console-friendly version of that that came out on consoles today. And this F450 is actually in the process of being turned into a console-friendly version as we speak. So I am about to head out and see if we can recover that P16 with this mega monster thing. Okay, maybe that's too much power. Um, let me go ahead no. and put... Oh, he's like, no, no, no such thing. Let's see. Are these mods in the in-game mod hub? Once again, the OBS is, and the original Spin Tires truck is, but once again, head over to your uh, your console mod hub, grab that Ford OBS, but this guy is not in the, uh, the console mod browser right now, and neither is the Silverado or a couple of the other trucks we're using. They are console friendly, but they are currently only on PC as they haven't been approved for consoles just yet, okay? And let's see. Whoop. God, this takes off. Wow, what a save right there. That's... I don't know if I can replicate that. That was... Uh, that was... Redonkulous. All right, I got to get down there. And what's up, James? I see you out there. And Jalen, we will see you when you get back, buddy. I'm going to try loading the P16 one more time. Well, I'm coming out there with, like, gigantic yeah, I don't expect tires and much, much, much power. Mucho power. Honestly, I don't really expect, because it's me, the uh. load to work properly. Okay. So I think you'll still be able to tow it. Oh. I mean, I've got so much power, like I said. I'm not, like... I just did a barrel roll. Okay, um... Very unexpected, but barrel roll achieved. Uh, what? Barrel roll achievement. Unlocked. Exactly. Let's see. That's blasphemy. No such thing as too much power. Exactly, Mr. Nut. Exactly. Let's see. Ooh. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Oh, boy. Right, let's make our way down at the inside. About to get to that bridge. Yep. All right. Now I'm going to bump to the river. And what's up, Tennessee Turtle Man? I see you out there in the chat. And they need to add a console mod 1996 Ford F-350. Hey, they've gotten really close because this is the latest uh, truck to drop on consoles. It is a flatbed uh, OBS Ford that is basically 
able to pull whatever trailers you want and you can also haul a side by side on here and yes it will pack so definitely check this thing out on the console mod browser it is on there today so i'm getting back in the f450 now and we are heading back down to our next destination and we're gonna try and recover that p16 with this thing and uh normally i would not be worried but uh i've gone ahead and put the max power tune in this thing because i think we're gonna need it and oh we are tumbling over oh god oh no oh oh no Oh, no. Jeez. All right. That went real well. Um, I'm well, literally... If you, want, if you want to see real well, uh, come and see what I've done here. Yeah, I'm I'll, surprised. I'll be I'm surprised I can move. Yeah, I'll be there momentarily. My bedside and my tailgate and my taillight are a bit damaged, but I am not going to worry about that. Is the plot... Flatbed set up for the gooseneck. I'm not sure on the Blitzo truck if it's set up for the gooseneck or not. That would be something that would be have to, uh, that would have to be confirmed by Limes. Let's see, why was the monstrosity taken off the mod hub? Um, it had unexpected branding on it, so it ran into some branding issues that they uh, and they ended up needing to remove it. So All I will right. say that the 3880 is officially OP. I mean, if we or... didn't know that before. Yeah, I mean, I think I've just put it through its final stress test. Oh, really? Yeah, I see your lights, so I'll just wait right where I am for you to see. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What? Wow. Is, uh, does the flatbed OBS only have a flatbed? Correct, Tossinator. It only has a flatbed. Mm -hmm. So, honestly, the, 30, the uh, P16 is going to fall off once I do this, so I'll let you pull it once I get it down here. We going out through the river. Oh my God! Yes, we are. All right, I'm gonna provide some light for you. Okay. With my mobile there sun. Ow. There's a tree there. I'm not sure if you were aware of that before. You're aware of it now, but yeah. let's see. Why does it? Why does your seven three sound? Or not seven three. Um. But why does your six seven sound like a six zero? Oh? I'm pretty sure that like. So a lot of different mod creators have used this sound file, and like I think it's just the highest quality like power stroke sound that they have. So let's see. <laughs> right game with stacks. It's freaking wild today, my dude. Wild. Mobile suck. Exactly, warrior. Exactly. Did you let go of the? Yeah, you did let go of the cat. Yeah, I did let go of the cat. Oh boy. Because I'm in a bit of a spot here. Also, have you noticed the sun is coming back up? Yes, I have. Okay. Well. Gabriel, what is up out there in the chat? All right, okay, I come am, on. I'm going to grab the cat. I think I can uh, just pull it out of there, I, I would hope. Oh, my God. the Dude, it just breaks my winch. The cat, like... Yeah. Actually, I'm going to winch... I hooked to something. Oh, I hooked to the P16. Wonderful. on oh my god dude my axles are bouncing so bad that like i would have broken everything oh 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 no don't pull into the other tree please oh my god no oh i had it now it's rolling again Ooh. let me turn around and use my bullies for what i brought them for I know, right, Risky? It's freaking wild! Absolutely freaking wild, my dude. All right, uh, sending these this way. I'll there we go. Right there. Sort of. All right, low minus, so as not to overstress it too much. Oh, wheelie, 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 oh God. We're gonna make it happen, boys. We're gonna make it happen. We're getting that cat out of there. Holy jeez. Oh, yes. The cat is out, boys. She good. All right, Diesel. I'm gonna move this thing down the road just a hair. All right. Is that Lime's truck? Uh, Yes, Risky. This is Lime's F450. Uh, AKA what he's gonna turn into the 2017 L400. 
we go. All right, do you want me to set off uh, with... Uh-oh. There's a task right there. Um, yeah, it might have to do with the bridge, I think. Well, the bridge looks like it's built, but there's like two fallen down trucks side by side. Oh, yeah, those ones. I forgot about that. Can we drive around those? Uh, Ethan Rose, um, is that truck on consoles? Not yet, but the truck that is on consoles as of today is this guy right here, the Blitzo Ford OBS flatbed. So definitely check that out on your console mod browser as of today, both on Xbox and PlayStation. Now, jumping back into the F450. Uh, oh, yeah, God. Yeah, we can, we can push those around. I just forgot that the bridge was there. Okay. Oh, you forgot that the bridge was there? Because I was going to yeah, say, I'm oh, used to. You just got it, Top Blocks? That's awesome. All right, I'm going to... Do you know what that task entails? Honestly, no, I don't. Hmm. I mean, is there any way we could pull these through the river and not, like, be completely screwed? Judging by the fact that I'm stuck on a tree, no. Okay, well, all right then. I have a, I have a new plan, I have a strategy, and I have an idea that I think may or may not work, and if I was able to do what I did earlier, I certainly can do this. Like, yeah, I'm gonna have to drag that P16 back up here. Oh, I'm dragging this thing, all right. Like, <laughs> it's gonna go where it needs to go. Like, there's no option to that. It's gonna go where it needs to go. Just don't worry about it on that front. Yeah. Same for the P16. I just thought, honestly, I could get it through the trees. Because I pulled shenanigans like this back on console, so I thought, okay, I can do it here. Nope. <laughs> Exactly. Oh, actually, if I winch it to the middle of the truck, it keeps the uh, the weight balance a lot more centralized and keeps my front axle down, which is a huge deal. Yeah, that's sixteen is huge. coming back up. If you have the option to winch to like the middle of the underside of your truck, do it. Like, absolutely freaking do it. Oh, we could get around those. That's not a problem. Although, I do need to depth test the water first. Because if I don't depth test the water and then I, like, and then I attempt this without depth testing, it might be bad. Let's see. Really confused. Are any of these mods on the in game mod hub or no? Once again, the Blitzo truck is the one on the in game mod hub as of today, along with a brand new uh, original spin tires truck that I highly recommend checking out as well by the creator Ranger. But yes, this guy is available on nope. the console mod hub as of today. Now I gotta get Here's back to the this. 50. Here's how we fix this problem in Diesel Land. Will those even move? Yes, yes they, they will. will. All right. Then, yep. Okay, I'm convinced. I thought they were going to be like, wait, shouldn't you turn the cat's engine on? It's broken. Yeah, I believe it's broken, Banana. I didn't try, but uh, Diesel, yeah, is it's it broken? broken? I was going to say. It's broken. It looks pretty dang broken to me. Okay, I know exactly where I'm going. Do you know? Yep. All right, I made my way around those trucks as well, and this cat is going so fast for having, like, blown everything. What's up, Logan Fuller? I see you out there in the chat. All right, let me winch yeah, that's it. again from the middle, because um, that way the truck drives so much better and pulls so much better and hauls so much better. Let's see. Is that... Wait. Is that a Ford F-250, the Blitzo? Um, it's a F-250 slash F-350 OBS, basically. He hasn't, you know, exactly specified if it's a 250 or a 350, but it's got elements of both, pretty much. Yeah, I'm just making my way now, just like putting that power down. We better get, <clears throat> we better get a healthy reward for this uh, for this uh, task, because it's a doozy. Yes. <clears throat> I cannot imagine doing this task on like full, um, like vanilla full vehicle. realism vanilla spec. That would be just like that would be torturous, man. That would be so exactly. bad. Let's see. Did Lime say anything about adding Dooley Fenders to the Ford? Um, honestly, like, 
I'm sure he does plan on it. I mean, again, this is a work in progress rig, so we'll have to wait and see for the future on that one. But it would look incredible with some dual defenders on it. I do agree, bro. I do absolutely agree. I'm gonna throw her in high. Actually, she's got the power for it. Let's get it. Oh, God. Oh, that's getting really bouncy out behind me. I'm like, I'm a little sketch about that. Oh, boy. Go, 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 go. Um, somebody was asking out in the chat if you bought the premium edition of the game and it came with the first, um, if it came with the year one pass, does that also mean you get the year two pass? Unfortunately, it does not mean that. So the, um, the year two pass is a separate thing. And yeah, Risky, I know. They'd have to be freaking wild. Charles, what is going on out there in the chat? I see you saying hi, checking in. Uh-oh. My driver's foot is coming through the 3880. Your what? Your driver's foot? Oh. Yep. Somebody, um, so you know, um, you know Fred and Dave from Dirt Every Day, right? Oh, yeah. So did you see the, uh, the big block, uh, Dodge that they recently got their hands on? No, I haven't, actually. So it, they got their hands on a um, their new, like, wheeling project. It's a four-speed manual, big block, um, single-cab short bed Dodge. And it's, like, it's the coolest thing ever. But, but they pulled it out of, like, a field or something. And the floor mm -hmm. pans are so rusted through that there's a photo of Dave just sitting in the cab. And you can see, you can see Dave's shoe underneath the truck. And it's, like... Okay. Oof. I think the caption was like, Dave tried to put his foot down and it went too far. <laughs> yeah, a little bit too far. Jackson and, uh, let's see, Yaharia, and let's see who else. Cameron, what's good? See you guys out there checking in in the chat. Oh, we're almost there, man. We're so close. All right, top blocks, we will see you when we get back. Wait, I don't really care about the past. I only want to know about the updates. So then what's your exact question? Like, what are you concerned about missing out on? I'm just trying to make sure, uh, Skiller, I'm just trying to make sure that I get your question exactly right so I can answer it to the best of my ability. Gavin Farms, what's up, my dude? You can see through the floor pans, you got that race level weight reduction package. Probably. <laughs> Probably. Do you prefer Ford or Dodge? Honestly, I go back and forth. I like both. I like different features of both. Um, let's see. Uh, can I see it? Please see the inside of that Ford driving right now. You got it, bud. Pretty dang cool, actually. But no, like, when it comes to Ford versus Dodge, I always, like, I always say, like, to me, it's like, Dodge always has, like, they have their amazing engines, but they don't know how to build a freaking transmission, so, and, and don't yeah. even, like, they don't, they have great engines. They don't know how to build a transmission. Hey, what's up? All right, well, last one to deliver. But, and the thing is, some people will say, well, what about like, you know, the Hellcat transmissions and like all the stuff in the Chargers? I'm like, that ain't Dodge, that's ZF. And ZF yep. builds amazing stuff. Which we know from like the ZF six speed behind the Duramax and the 7.3 Power Stroke. Exactly, like ZF, well, and the crazy part is ZF makes like truck transmissions, car transmissions. ZF has been the top transmission supplier for BMW for like 15 years or something like that. 10 years, 15 years, I don't even know. There we go! Drop it off. You know off. what this means? You get to keep all the trucks and sell them all. Exactly. You can sell them all and we can grab a metal from this, uh, from this, uh, this area now. Let's see, I'm worried that if I don't buy the pass, I don't get all the updates. So you'll get all the updates no matter what, uh, but buying the pass means they will or will not be unlocked, basically. But yeah, hopefully that answers your question, bro. So I'm actually going to recover this guy, repair him real quick, and then, yes, I'm gonna, I'm gonna sell these guys. I'm gonna recover them, and I'm gonna retain them. And P16, recover. Retain and 745C. Recover, retain and oh god! All right, storage. Sell, sell, sell. And oh, I have my brigadier in there. I need to bring my brigadier outside because uh, my brigadier is really good for like you know the road stuff. And let's see. 
Oh, I went absolutely nuts, Bethany Harrison. Absolutely freaking wild. What's up, Eddie Three? Welcome back. And let's see, what are some of the future console mods? Actually, we're using some of the future ones in here right now. And I was a blithering idiot and bumped into a Dodge Durango right outside the garage, but uh, it's all good. Oh, that Dodge Durango just phased away. All right. All right, Diesel. What is next on our ever-growing to-do list? <laughs> Honestly, I'm not sure, but I have a 3880 with an 8-slot ready for anything. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. All right. Let me, uh, let me let this guy chill. Oh, and oh. a Brigadier was loaded with, like, uh, fruits and veggies and stuff, so. Yeah. Oh, oh, God. I forgot where my Chevrolet was. All right, so you got the fruit and the uh, food, fruit, vegetables, whatever. Um, yeah. I hope insurance can pay for that. Ah, it's fine. Um, what map is this? This, my friend, is Highway Holland, and it is freaking amazing. Bear King? Ah, they despawn like that sometimes. It's fine. Don't worry about it. All righty, so let's grab. All right, building bridges, site one. Deliver the bridge material. Diesel? Yeah. We're blithering morons. <laughs> that bridge that we went around could have been built before, couldn't it? Yep. But it. Ain't, but the, here's where it gets weird. It ain't a task. It's a contract. That's where he gets you. <sighs> That's where he gets you. That, oh my god. Hey, Logan's back. What is good? If you try grabbing the fuel taker off the main highway, I mean... I haven't tried grabbing it yet, but, like, we haven't needed it yet. You know what I mean? So we need two units of metal beams and four units of concrete slabs. I'm going to grab myself a gooseneck, and we're going to get hauling. Uh, he's freaking ready, bud. I'll tell you that. All right. Um, right. I'll handle the beams if you handle the concrete. Does that sound good, Diesel? Yeah, that sounds good. I was going to say, that's probably concrete. the approach we were going to do anyway, but... Oh. Ah, the concrete is further down the road. Gotcha. Wait a second. Oh, there's the... There it is. Okay, this is probably a little bigger than I need, but I ain't worried about it. It's gonna be all good anyway. And I figure also, since I was hauling with the power stroke, I mean, I'll haul with the Duramax for a little while. This thing rips. But, and also, it is fully console friendly. For anybody that hasn't seen this truck yet, this is fully console friendly and hopefully will be available at some point soon. Hopefully, as long as it passes approval. All right, I'm heading up to the metal. Ooh, uh, oh, God. Hurt. What happened? All right, Lennox, we will see when you get back, bro. May have lost a little bit of control and wound up bouncing the 3880s front bumper off of a culvert. Oh, jeez. Jesus. Is this Baja edge of control? Yes. If it's me driving, then yes. No, I... It, when it's you driving, it's just road, edge of control. <laughs> exactly. But um, I saw this, oh my God. Like somebody showed me this freaking, like what was it? It was like, it was either like an Instagram reel or like a TikTok or something. And it was like, in North America, it's like, oh, we drive on the right side of the road. It's like in England, we drive on the left side of the road. And it's like in, uh, um, in Russia, road is road. Oh, this is not good. But to be fair, that's kind of what SnowRunner feels like when you go into, like, Ammer. You know what I mean? <laughs> exactly. Just road is road. All right. Road? So... Ouch. You know, we they could have done a better her. job on this pool noodle of a trailer. <laughs> pool noodle. Ah! Rizky is like, road is road. <laughs> oh, my God. Matty, welcome back, my dude. We are in the brand new Silverado Duramax doing a uh, metal beam haul to get this bridge built. And um, also, uh, let's see. And I see Elizabeth, what is going on out there in the chat? Can I get a sheesh? <laughs> yep, what's up? You got it. All right, uh, I'm gonna have to just um, go straight through here. Big yike. Also, let me activate my, um, my uh, cargo support. There we go. This thing has an active suspension, but it's completely and totally designed to support cargo weight. And so only the rear end of the truck lifts up to provide you that extra support, which is super nice, either when you're hauling really heavy cargo or when you load your trailer wrong, like this present moment. Um, 
or when the game auto loads your trailer uh, incorrect of how you would load it in real life. But I really, in hindsight, should have taken the four unit one and not the six unit one, and then I wouldn't have confused the game. So that's really on me at the end of the, uh, the end of the day. Steak says land is road. There you go. Yes. Ah, cool. So just bomb down this road here, and we're good. Let's see. Hey, TC, just wondering, do you play Snowrunner even when you don't record videos? I've always been uh, been curious. Yeah, man, I actually uh, really enjoy playing the game, even when I'm not, like, filming or, like, streaming. I, I really do enjoy just kind of playing this game to chill out and hang out. It's a, it's a really fun game to play, to hang out with friends, or just to relax, honestly. Like, you can play this game in, like, a competitive sense, like Steak does, or you can play it in a really chill, relaxed sense. It's 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 got so many different, you know, ways you can play it, especially when you start getting into the mod, uh, you know, the mod ecosystem and the mod world, my dude. God, I love doing hauls in this truck. It's so, like, it's so chill, it's so relaxing, and yet, like, bro, is this Silverado available for console mods? Um, it will be soon as long as it gets approved, uh, but it's got to be tested first. It's fully console-friendly, though. All right, let's get to that bridge, and... What? Yo, you already got him dropped off? Heck yeah, dude! Let's see, Ian uh, says, Hi, TC and Diesel, coffee time. Let's see, trailer Dorifto. Oh, you better freaking believe it, bud. You haven't seen... Uh-oh. Oh, jeez. Oh, what are you doing? Get Trying to get your, out of the way. Get your pool noodle out of here, bud. <laughs> well, there you go. Oh, my God, it really is twisted up like a freaking noodle... Boom! She complete! Oh, this would have been so freaking, like, helpful. Easy. This would have been so helpful to have earlier. Like, I'm telling you, it just, oh. I feel so bad about the fact that we didn't do this earlier. Like, I feel like yeah. we made everything so much harder on ourselves solely because of this. Freshly85 Gaming, what is up out there in the chat, my dude? Thank you so much for stopping by. I genuinely appreciate it, my dude. All right, so I am going to, let's see. So you're heading back. I got to head back and um, sell this trailer. But let's also see. Well, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, boy. So uh oh, uh oh. Actually, steel Ended beams up in the and day. concrete slabs. What bridge are we working on there? Oh, bridge site two. Bro, we building another bridge. All right, hope, sounds good. Hope you enjoy concrete slabs, because... I gotta get more of them, huh? Yep, you gotta get more of them, bud. Let's see. You know also, what's bad? We're not even diesel will make a bet with me. Ah, don't worry about it, Steak. It's fine. I wouldn't either. <laughs> and let's see. Look away. Oh, no worries, man. No worries at all. So what's up, Diesel? Yeah, I might be stuck and blocking the road. Uh, it's okay. No worries. I got that uh, that Nerd Max power, and I'm gonna go ahead and hold. Oh. Please, smokes, help you out. Xander, yeah, welcome back. Beast Gamer, anything kidding. is road. Yes. Except air. That's no, not road. Air is not road. I will agree with that. Yeah, am I the only one who hated the Jetsons hot flying cars, by the way? Oh, I mean, but I love the noises they make. Like, is that bad? It's like, they're super satisfying. Yeah, they can be satisfying, but at the same time, it's like, you know, a car is supposed to have wheels, not hover. Yeah, you're like, air, you're like, no, sky is not road. <laughs> exactly. I mean, I guess it would have been fine if they had just called them hovercrafts or, like, realistic hovercrafts. Yeah. Ouch. But then again, hovercrafts don't go that high. Although I have heard that hovercrafts are freaking weird to try to control, and like I really want to try to drive one someday just to find out for myself. Yeah, that would definitely be an interesting experience. It'd be an interesting video. I was literally, I'll put my GoPro on my head. I'll go full head cam status on that. Also, I am working on a video that I was cooking up with a friend of mine um, this past week, actually. So let me know out there in the chat if you guys would like to see me post this video. But um, basically, um, when I was out doing some driving in the mountains with a buddy of mine, I was in the BRZ, and he was in his uh, SR20 swapped S13, and we got the chance to do a pretty clear, like, you know, open drive together with, like, little to no traffic at all. And I had my, um, my external mic on my GoPro and everything, and I got, like, some really good exhaust sound of both the BRZ and some engine sound of his SR20. And so it was literally just, like, 
a SR20 swapped S13 chasing a BRZ through the mountains. It's literally just like pure driving. Let's go ahead and... Oh, actually, I don't know if I want to load this up like this yet because the BRZ... Not the BRZ, what the heck? This trailer was crap when I tried it before, so I'm going to swap out for the short trailer. But yeah, the BRZ did do a great job, though, this past week. It was awesome. Um, and this next week, I need to get... Let's see, next Wednesday, I'm getting an oil change and fluid refresh done on the S2000, and I probably need to order some new wheels for the S2000 as well because guess who has a... You ready to cry? So, because I cried too. So, um, you know how that car has a set of like limited edition 17 by 10 Advan wheels? Yeah, I, uh, mm. yours truly bent one of them really bad and now I need new wheels and they don't make those Advans anymore. So, RIP me, um, but I'm going to start looking around to see what wheels would be the best for that car. But, uh, yeah, my limited edition 17 by 10 Advans are, like, at least three out of four are okay. But one of them, the barrel, it's, like, it's not even that I bent the lip. I bent the barrel. So, it's, like, it can never be trued back again. So, or at least it can never be fully trued again. So, I'm kind of, like, oofed on that one. Yeah, I gotcha. Also, ignore the fact that I took a wrong turn and went the complete and total wrong way. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, Puppy says, oof! Risk, he says, that only happened because of all that VTech. And I'm like, ah, it's fine. Yeah, remember how oh. in the last S2000 video, guys, remember how the, the camera was shaking all over the place? That was because of the vibrations from the bent wheel. He, that's even with, like, even with putting it on, like, the passenger side rear, it still transmits that much vibration. So it's like, I just need new wheels. I mean, but you know what? I mean, when, when that car jumps, you know, Curb, uh, curbings at the track enough times, you know, that sometimes you bend a wheel or two. I mean, and this is the biggest thing that people don't understand is, uh, and a lot of people get like really triggered by this statement, but when you're talking about like track cars, wheels are consumable. Wheels are consumables. And that's, and I don't know, Colton and Rhonda B, what is going on, you guys? But yeah, uh, wheels are consumables no matter how upset that makes certain people. <laughs> It can be a wheel problem sometimes. Uh, yeah. It can cause some wheel issues. <laughs> some people might get tired of it too, though. I mean, and depending on, uh, depending on how tired they get, it can end up being a wheelie bad day. This is a bit of a rim shot at times, isn't it? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> that was like, dude, oh my god. We got some momentum with that one. Oh yeah. We got some got some mileage out of that. Oh, that was unintentional actually. That was unintentional, but you know what? The joke still works. <laughs> Wait, what? Uh, um why are you I missed the turn again. You've now missed the turn twice. Yes. Why are you Hi. Hello. <laughs> I'm um I'm gonna pass you. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that sounds like a good idea since I apparently don't know where I'm going. Let's see. Oh God. Let's see. Should have had a, a a track set spare. Oh, I should have. I lesson learned. And he goes. By the way, terrible puns. I know, right? By the way, you guys are about to blow through that 600 likes mark on the stream. But honestly, if I change up to a different set of wheels on the S2000, well, I'm gonna have to. But when I do, not if I do, but when I do, has what is going on, my dude? And Bryce Shields, I see you saying hi out there as well. But once again, um, when I change up to a different set of wheels on the S2000, I'll probably go um, with some Titan 7s, similar to what I have on the uh, BRZ. But what I love about them is the fact that, like, they're actual forged wheels for really good prices. You know what I mean? Uh, let's see, I'm gonna have to go, getting a bad headache. Oh no, all right, Hossinator, I hope you feel better soon, man. Thank you for hanging out while you could, but yeah, go get some sleep, go get some rest. Um, but yeah, I'll probably end up going with another set of Titan 7 wheels on the S2000. Like, not a sponsor or anything like that, by the way, you know, not a plug, but like, I just I just like their wheels because literally it's it's high quality forged wheels for not crazy prices. And, and as bad as it sounds, like, I don't really feel all that bad about like, you know, beating them up at the track, you know what I mean? Like because they're like titan sevens were literally designed for people that take their cars to the track and need a strong wheel at like a competitive price and um and that's why i just that's why i have them on the brz and that's why i don't feel bad about beating them up on track oh that's six move one 
Let's see. He says, I run Titan 7s on my E36 M3. Good choice. Yeah, dude. I have them on my BRZ. They've been great. And I'm probably going to go with them uh, for my replacement set on the S2000 pretty soon. Because the tires on the S2000 are still good. I mean, I got a set of uh, Hankook RS4s on it that only have a couple of events on them. And so they still have a crap ton of, like, you know, tread life and heat cycling left in them. So I would just need to swap, uh, swap the tires over to the new wheels. All right. New bridge about to be built. And boom, boom. Somebody said, TC, start uh, start up the console truck. I will in a second. Oh, ah! I almost got attacked at the rear. <laughs> hey. <laughs> and now we can take this route back, I believe. There we go. We? Let's see. What's that route look like? Um, Honestly, it doesn't look bad at all. But it doesn't look like it goes anywhere. It looks like it goes hmm. to the end of the map. <laughs> well, I'm going to find out at least. You know what? I'm going to take that way as well because I think I found a garage shortcut. Um, let's yep. see. Uh, we will be starting up the new um, the new uh, Blitzo truck, uh, the new consoles truck. In just a moment, we just got to drive this thing back to the garage and sell this, um, this short trailer because I'm not going to be using it anymore. But um, I just needed to use it to get that task done. But after this, we're going to be changing up to a different truck, probably the Blitzo or a combination of the Blitzo and uh, Lime's F450. And we're going to be getting a couple more tasks done out here on Highway Holland, y'all. Let's see. Whoa. So I did a thing. Uh, are you, or I should say, is your machinery disabled at the current moment in time? Uh-oh. Oh, oh. Oh, my. Oh, my. Yeah, I can fix this. I'm going to pass you. <laughs> How about no? <laughs> How about... Good! I've narrowly escaped being flattened. Just narrowly. Let's see. TC versus Diesel. Pun battle. Your theme is food. Go. Well, but we don't have anything to like. Um, is the Duramax out for, uh, out for consoles yet? Just got out of school. Not yet. No, 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 no. It still has to pass testing. But the newest available console mod right now is uh, oh, is this guy right here. The Blitzo truck, which is a console-friendly OBS um, Ford with a flatbed. Fully available on the console mod browser as of today. All good to go as of today. And, oh, happy belated birthday, Jacob, uh, for sure. Cody O'Claw, what's up, man? I see you saying hi out there in the chat. And by the way, you guys blew through that 600 likes mark on the stream. Thank you so much. Jumping back into the Dually 3500 now. Making my way up the road, trying to find a back way to the garage. Hopefully, I find one. Hopefully, the guardrail ends. And it does. Warning, there may be, there may be deer in road. I'm not going to worry about deer because, uh, well, I'll just honk at them. Is that bad that I was, like, driving at night the other day and I saw, like, three deer just milling around on the side of the road and honked at them and they took off into the woods? Like, now in hindsight, I probably shouldn't have honked at them because they also very well could have turned around and ran the other way and ran into my car, but... Yeah. <laughs> that might have been a problem. Also, there is a sign stuck in my truck. <laughs> Maybe it's a sign. It's... Yeah, it might be because I am wedged. Yeah? I'm, I'm actually completely stuck. Oh, dear. Well, I I'm found a shortcut painting. to the trailer store, if that makes you feel any better. But is the yeah, Berlay on consoles? Not yet, my dude. Let's see. Get some 17 by 10 TE37 Sagas for the S2K. The only problem with those, I love them. But my God, I would feel a little bit bad inside beating them up. Because you got to remember, I run like really, really dusty, loud, like Carbotech race pads or either Carbotech race pads or Hawk race pads on my cars. And they destroy the surface of a wheel really, really quickly. Like even if you clean your wheels like three times a week, they still get bad after a while. And so that's why I'm trying to keep up with like keeping the wheels on the BRZ fairly clean. But like you can still kind of tell that like oh, the surface no. is getting to them. Uh oh, what happened? Um. Uh... This sign is so wedged in my truck, it almost tore the cab off the 3880. Oh my god! <laughs> like, the, the cab is now a stationary object. Oh my god! Alright, I'm gonna try and, like, help you out in the, uh, in the Blitzo truck. By the way, guys, Blitzo truck, aka a flatbed Ford OBS, available on consoles as of today. Check your mod browser, sort by latest update. Is that map coming to consoles? Heck yeah, it freaking should! 
It should be. I see no reason why it wouldn't. Yeah, Let's go. I, Mr. Sandman, what I'm is part of the map now. You're part of the map now, bruh. I'm. I am speechless. I'm about to pull over a tree. Holy cow! This tree is not even capable of being broken by the twin steer, and I'm about to pull it over. Oh my jeez. All right. Well, I'm on my way up there. Let's see. Flashbacks to the other day, TC. Your truck had the same problem. I know. Like literally, like the past uh, stream on Friday. My truck did have the, the problem that Diesel is having right now. So I'm making my way uh, towards you right now, bud. Yeah. Let's see, I think that's, it's time uh... to assist Diesel. Yes, Banana, you are correct. Diesel needs an assisty boy. Go, 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 go. Yeah! Go, go. Come on. It might be a bit stuck. Okay. All right. Let me show you what's been going on here. Oh, oh, I see the sign. I see the sign. Okay. Okay. You know what fixed it for... Are you okay now? Nope, it's stuck in the ground Okay, again. you know what fixed it for me? Switch your truck. Like, switch it to another truck and then come back into this truck. Good Lord, Kevin92FoxBody. That is ridiculous. I am glad you're okay. I'm genuinely glad you are okay. And it's free. Heck Holy yeah, dude. Ow. All right, let me back up. That was disturbing. What? Oh, that experience just in general? Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right, I'm going to okay, find so out what's I'll at the end of this road because there may be a secret down here. You, uh, by okay. the way, so you can actually, you'll probably be able to fit as well. There's a shortcut through here that goes right to the trailer store. And if you want to sell that, you can. Oh my God. He just dove into it and went for it. What? <laughs> Holy moly. Let's see. Uh, ceramic cook your wheels and it should rinse off no problem. Batter switch to PFCs. Brake dust isn't as harsh on the finish of your wheels. That's my experience with track pads. So I've got some friends actually that have had really good experience with the PFC race pads. I've only ever tried the two main ones that I've run are Hawk DTC 60s. I ran those on the S2000 for a while. That's what I still have on the uh, S2000 is Hawk DTC 60s. And they're really bad for um, like for the wheel surface. And uh, on the BRZ right now, I have a Carbotech combo. I have um, Carbotech, what is it? Oh God, uh, XP 10s in the front and XP 8s in the back. And it's really well balanced. It works amazing. Um, and I actually like the performance of the Carbotechs on the track a little bit more than the Hawks because like the Hawks have better bite, but they're not as consistent. Whereas the Carbotechs are just consistency for days. I've never tried a PFC pad though, and I really should. I'm gonna figure out if there's a way for me to get up there and oh i can get up this <laughs> oh you know what though this would probably be easy yeah there's a tunnel ahead and so i bet you what this is uh, or li at least what this is gonna be this is gonna be a um like a transition spot where you would go to another map in this region um for later on when he expands because there's a tunnel up here at the end of that road diesel okay also Ooh. you might want to come and sit come back to the garage and see what i can do See what you I just can found... do. <laughs> yeah, I just found out you can do this. Okay. Um, let me discover this one last little spot real quick, just to have okay. like full map discovery. Oh dang it! Oh, I'm a, I'm a doofus. Yep. I see it rolling over on the map. Yep, I'm a doofus 101. All right, hold on, getting back on the main road. It's fine. There's Whoa. a trailer up there. There's a what? Where? Where you're headed, there's a trailer behind the building. What? what? Yeah, it's like it's like the big oil rig trailer from the uh, Michigan maps. Hold up. And what's this loading? Yeah, that. Oh. Yeah, on your left. Yes, it is. Oh, that's got to be part of a contract or a task later. But um, this uh, up here is where all your service parts are. So okay, it's a, that it's makes a loading sense. zone for um, what is it? Uh, let's see, it's two different things: service spare parts and vehicle spare parts, and it has ten cargo units of each. All right, I'm gonna recover and I'm gonna leave the garage. I'm in my, I'm in me Blitzo truck. Right here. Uh oh. All right. Okay, you ready? Yep. He's sending it. Oh my God, Jesus, dude, what? 
Okay. Let's see. My aim was a bit off. You're right. But it goes. Uh, Oops. Oh, you left Highway Holland. Uh, nope. If I did, I didn't mean to. You left the so game. So I should. Like, you All right. left, left the game. Uh, do you know if anyone is making a console friendly 2021 Can Am? Um, not at the moment, I don't know, but hopefully they'll do something like that in the future. I would love to see Mega Send. Yeah, yeet. Yeah, I, uh, let's see. Um,. Oh, okay, so oh Re uh, Remo's working on a few more maps. Oh, yeah. Let's see. Remo said that every tunnel you will see will lead to another map in the future. Yeah, man. I was actually talking to Remo about that just earlier today. And uh, we've got some stuff cooking up in the works. So make sure you guys stay tuned to Remo's channel and my channel because there's going to be some really interesting stuff coming from both of us pretty soon. Now, there's... Uh-oh. Holding back in. There's a flipped over truck out there in that swamp up on the top of the hill. I am very curious. Okay, you joined, by the way. Like, you can join just fine, so I'm not okay, yeah. worried about it. I um, think it was like a little internet hiccup or something. On yeah, my end. it just, like, just kicked you out of the game. It was just like, okay, yeah, he he be heckin' gone. All right, farmers That's like, feed you don't need cities, to be in here. And what is this one? Oh, nope. Ah! Okay, All so right. actually, if you want to try that again, I'll show you what it was. Oh! So, there's a task that you might want, or rather, a contract that you might want. Deliver okay. the new 770 to the farm. It's basically a Cat 770G in pieces on a low saddle gooseneck. Um, okay. It's, it's down at the wharf, and I guarantee you, you'll be able to get it done really quickly. So, what I might do is hmm. tell you what, actually, or do you want to work on some tasks while I take the Brigadier out there? I was actually just about to take my Brigadier out and see hey. if I could tell the 770 back with it. Well, like, hmm. Let me see what tasks there are out that way. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, you've already got consumables loaded up for the other farm task or other farm contract. That's good. So yeah. why don't you move those to the gas station so they can be easily loaded up? Um, and I'll go get that 770. And then we'll be ready to go. By the way, you guys, how are you guys doing out there in the chat? What has been your favorite console mod as of today that you have tried? Have you tried out the Blitzo truck? Have you tried out the new uh, OG Spin Tires truck? Have you tried out any new maps? Have you tried out any tweaked trucks? Let me know out there in the chat. So Diesel's going to go ahead and grab his food trailer or his, like, consumables trailer from the farm. And I am going to head to grab the new 770G and deliver it to the farm in pieces. But it should be good to go. Yeah, so I'm headed your way, because that's actually my trailer back there, yep. and it stuck my Brigadier back in the garage. All right. So and my I Brigadier got now has... On my dash. Wow, I just drove into a ditch, uphill, and back out of it again, in, like, rear-wheel drive only with no lockers. Although, I ran over... Okay, this is my gripe with vanilla trucks every time I drive them. There was a stick, okay, a stick on the road... And Nuts. it caused me over 50% suspension damage. And I didn't even drive over it that so fast. So my trailer... My trailer has glitched. And it has dumped all but two oh God. loads of food off of it. How? I don't know, but now it's stuck. That legit doesn't make any sense. Actually, if you stop and think about it, it kind of does. Well, yeah. I mean, do you have a crane? On this one, no. So I think it's going to gotcha, be 3880 gotcha. to the rescue again. Dude, a lot of people are putting their yep. uh, their favorite mods out there in the chat. And, like, Paystar by JBoosted is amazing. Absolutely, I agree. So is the r, &R Gladiator. So is the L400. Killer1115 with that $20 super chat saying hi. Thank you so much once again, my dude. Let's see. Uh, I have one in my project vault. Ooh, interesting. But um, once again, Killer, thank you so much for that $20 super chat. I genuinely appreciate all of your incredible support out here on the channel and out here on the stream. Yo, you guys that love the L400 are going to be so down for that new L400 when it drops. The 2017 one based on Lime's F450. Woohoo! I got a little out of sorts there for a second. You doing okay, Beans? Hey, he's doing fine. All right, slow down, slow down, slow down. All right, there we go. Good to go. Make sure I'm going the right way. Uh, 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 yes, I am. All right. Let's see. 
You turn your Still lights on truck. with LB and B. Yes, this is correct. <laughs> what were you saying? Recovery truck. Recovery truck just flipped over the brigadier. Oh heck yeah. Well, it was upright beforehand, and now all the oh! cargo is spilled. Oh, not heck yeah. Oh, I thought that you meant you were rescuing it. Well, I am. But not but, uh, not because it was already... I, I get it now. Ashley H., what yeah. is going on out there in the chat? I see you checking in. All right, I'll probably pass through this um, this uh, fuel station on the way back. I've never taken this road. Venom at 5, what is going on out there in the chat, my dude? And let's see. Rolling past this, uh, oh, I remember that big parking lot. That's nearby to the, um, woo. Ah. Ooh. Ooh. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. All right, I should be dropping by the port very, very, very soon. Justin, what is going on out there in the chat? Somebody said the second gen is their favorite right now, which I completely get that as well. Do I have any repair points? Nope. These gates go up. Okay, so, hmm, do I need to do something to open these gates? I must need to do something to open these gates. Uh, should I buy the GMC Brigadier? I think so. At, at the very least, you should buy it for the sound. The sound is so good. I know it's you're probably, also a pretty fast truck. It is. I know you're probably meant to, like, do some other, oh, God, oh, God. The physics on these poles are a little stabby, and they try to cause you damage. And, uh, oh, jeez. All right, I'm going to go around that uh, that gate. I know you're probably not supposed to. I know there's probably, like, a task that's involved where you're supposed to, like, you know, mess with the tasks to unlock the gate. But, ah, I'm not going to worry about it. Got some kind of task over there as well. And there should be an entrance up here. And, well, maybe not. Oh, no, there is. Okay, we're good there. And, ah! Oh boy! All right, we also got a um, a massive oil trailer out here, which I'm sure will come into play later on in the future. I get that as well, Maddie, for sure. All right, we're hooked. Let's head out. All right, me and Beans are on our way with this uh, fully disassembled 770G. We also got a cargo loading point out here at the docks. And let's see. All right. So I'm thinking, hmm, there's like two different ways we could go. We could go, oh, thank you, Tristan. I appreciate it. Sir Yeats a lot. Oh, you know it. That's actually diesel, but ah. Eh. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Only sometimes. That right? Man, we really like put some mad progress into this map this time. Even though we literally like started all the way over, it doesn't it doesn't even matter. We we put some mad progress on this place. Oh yeah. And honestly like to be fair, I feel like it was almost worth starting back over again because like our first attempt was so like wacky and sketchy. Uh this one wasn't? <laughs> well, yeah, but we knew more going into it this time. There is that aspect. Come on. Make it around the gate. Make it around the gate. Yes. I'm going to leave my 3880 at the fuel station in case either one of us needs a recovery truck. That's a good idea. Oh, no. Really? Really? I also love how you can just so haphazardly pack your cargo, and it'll still pack it. Oh, I know. Yeah, it doesn't care how you pack it, so long as it's on the trailer. Yeah, and also, this Brigadier, if anybody's on the fence about buying it, this thing can My actually God. take high gear from a near-standing start. Yeah, it really, truly can. Uh-oh. Not again. Not again. Not again. Not again. Uh-oh. What I have no idea do? how I saved that, but I will take it. Hey, you don't always have to know how. You just have to know what. <laughs> yes. Now, if I can get this thing out of the ditch. I'm in a bit of a predicament here. Oh, you now, too, huh? Granted, it's a bit of a predicament of my own doing, but uh, 
Oh, 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 there you go! Get it! Come on! Maybe the gate's only open during the daytime. That could be, but, I mean, you never know. That would I, be a perfect moment. I think it, yeah, I know, right? I think it's still probably tied to a task. You know what I mean? I, I genuinely believe it's probably tied to a task. But we are good to go. Threw it right into high. This thing is so good for, like, uh, for what it is. Oh, my God. For default truck, it's amazing. Yeah, and this poor Brigadier, I do like it. I just wish I hadn't been such an idiot. What did you do this time? The trailer is stuck on a culvert again. Again? Yeah, the first one was with the 3880, now it's with the Brigadier. Bruh, that GMC power, though. Uh, yeah, that it would have been about fine. To drive off a cliff, though. Uh, do you need a tow truck? Uh, I just kind of high-centered myself. It's okay, don't worry about it, but, uh... Oh, please tell me that which one is solid. No! Only one way to fix this now. So this flatbed goes to the fuel station, right? Uh, sure. That's one of the places I think it goes. Come on! Oh, I, I centered! Let's see. Colton Hagen apparently says a brand new mud truck just got added, and I'm not sure which one he's talking about. I think he's probably talking about the Blitzo. The Blitzo is, um, are you talking about the 63 Mega, or are you talking about the Blitzo? The 63 Mega was out uh, this past week, but um, but the Blitzo came out today, and it's very multi-purpose. You can use it for a Scout, you can use it for a mud truck. It's basically a, um, a Ford OBS with a flatbed on it. It's actually a really fun truck to use. But, um, yeah, okay, so, I'm gonna have to actually disconnect my trailer, because, oh god, oh god, oh god, that trailer's backing up, that trailer is backing up, but I'm okay now, ooh, ooh. okay, I'm okay now, wow, that was a close call, holy smokerinos, alright, that was, that was like one of the closest calls I have ever had. Cause it literally, um, it literally just started rolling off. Glitchworks just released his. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, are you talking about trucks that are on just PC? Or oh, wait a minute. Consoles? Wait a minute. I think I know what he means. Generic mud truck by Glitch. Oh, that's not on consoles yet, but that just dropped on PC. And Diesel okay, and I gotcha. definitely need to check that thing out. I will be checking that thing out very, very shortly. And what I might do, actually, just to kind of change things up a bit is we may actually switch up and go to a mud map after we make these uh, these final deliveries. Um, how about after I deliver this cat, we'll just head straight to a mudding map. We'll just have yeah, some that fun and uh, just go nuts. Why am I going backwards? Am I? Oh my god. Can I not climb this hill? There we go. You know, I'm really glad that this hour of the night there's nobody on the highway because I can do some really sketchy stuff. Dude. I'm in trouble. I'm like, I can't make it up the hill. That's what I mean. Sorry. Right. Oh, yeah. No worries. Jerk Mud Truck versus Powerhouse. You know, Risky, you might have yourself a challenge right there. That would be a fun one, actually, for Diesel and I to do. Oh, yeah. Like, maybe <laughs> Stadium Super Truck. Excuse me. Hey. I'm so down for that. I'm playing this map at night and it's super difficult. It's, uh, it has its moments for sure. All right, All right let me leave this, this trailer. Hill. Huh? Okay, I was just, I was just going to say, I'd leave this trailer here at the fuel station. Then I was going to grab 3880 and come and pull you if you needed it. All right, man, sounds good. Uh, let's see, Lucas says, TZ, what are the new console mods I just got out of school? So this, um, at least the new console mods as of today, are you have the new Blitzo truck, which is a flatbed Ford OBS, which is now available on the console mod browser, in addition to a truck by Ranger that is based on the OG blue hauling truck, uh, the classic one from the original spin tires. And those are going to be your brand new um, console mods as of today. Tara, what is going on in the chat? I see you out there. I'm just taking the main road. I'm going to take the main bridge. I'm going to, like, play this as safe as I can. And then we're going to drop this off the farm, and we're going to literally, like, yeet ourselves on over to a uh, mudding map or or a multi-purpose map such as Super Truck Stadium. Or we could do, oh, we could do Truck Night because it's got all the different worlds. And didn't Frank just update that? I saw him in the chat about half an hour ago. I saw him in the chat too, but I don't know if he updated it. You know what I mean? 
Yeah, I could have sworn I saw an update for it the other day, though. Huh. I didn't, I didn't realize it got updated. If it did, that's news to me. All right. Yeah, that... The main bridge now. Whoops. My locator should pop up any second, actually. David, what is going on in the chat, my dude? I see you chilling out and saying hi. You know, actually, I'm pretty impressed with this truck's fuel mileage, too. Like, when it's towing, it's not bad. Oh, yeah, he yeah. had to update it. Oh, for phase four, he had to. Oh, that makes sense. Okay. Yeah, I had to unsub and resub it because apparently mod IO updates are broken now. Yeah, they are. Um. So note to self, don't chuck the 3880 into high gear when going around a corner. Um, Diesel, I yeah. messed up. I took the wrong turn. Thankfully, I'm at a spot um, where I can turn around, but uh, that's a bit of an oof. All right, I see you actually on the map. And where does that go again? This goes to the farm, but I thought it was going to go to the farm where you actually grab food from. It's not. It's the, it's the farm where you originally start your playthrough. Oh. So I'm just going to have to take the other... Um, let's see. The new blue truck for consoles my whole childhood. Exactly, Kyle. That's what I'm saying. You OG Spin Tires fans, right? You guys are going to love that thing. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. All right, don't hit the walls. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. <laughs> Where are you, by the way? Oh, you're coming up behind me. Okay. Yep. No worries there. Garrett Drake, what is good, man? I see you saying hi. Is this a mod map or no? See, but that's the cool thing, is that um, this is a mod map, but you wouldn't know it when you first looked at it, would you? It's like, it's so good, you know? Oh, I see, like, a giant amount of light behind me. That can only be Diesel's 3880. Or Lime's F450, but I'm driving the 3880. I figured. Oh, dear Lord. I'm sorry. I changed lanes on you unexpectedly. Yeah. Well, I could have run in the dirt, but either way. Eh, no worries about it. Press Wolf, well, what's good, man? I see you saying hey, TC, in the chat. All right, come on. Oh, God. Build some speed. Build some speed back up. Dude, I can literally, even with a disassembled 770G on the back of my trailer, I can go from second to high going uphill. Like, the torque on this thing. Um, I'm wheeling! Oh, God! Oh, no. I was gonna try and pull you. Please help. Please help! Uh, Alejandro, can someone please confirm what? Um, he said, can someone please confirm, question mark, but he didn't say what to confirm. Uh, what do we need to be, uh, what do you need confirmed, bro? We can confirm it, like... Hopefully, as long as it's like public info, you know what I mean? Yeah, the truck he's talking about, it's actually not a Chevy High Country. It's the uh, generic 3500 by Limes. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, it's not on consoles yet, but it hopefully will be soon as long as it, um, as long as it gets approved. Uh-huh. Also, public service announcement for the moderators. I see people continuing to ask in the chat about Monster Max. It's not a public mod, and it will never come to consoles, okay, guys? But there will be, to follow him up on that, there will be other monster trucks dropping on consoles, and actually, recently, there have been a couple that have already dropped. So, no worries about that. Oh, thank you, Left Foot Nick. I appreciate it. But, um, but no worries about that. But, yeah, as of this current moment in time, um, Monster Max, in all of its ver versions and variants, is, uh, is not a console rig. Tucker be like, roads confirmed. Yes. Long road. No, nope, right. never mind. Right road. Yep. Right road. Sorry. Right road? Right wrong. Right left? Uh, right Sasquatch. S Actually, we haven't seen him yet, have we? Uh, not on this map. Dude, oh my god. I put the all-terrain tires on this thing, and it's kind of... Oh, there we go. It was tricky for me to pick up some momentum, even on, uh, even on dirt. But I'll tell you, this thing, though, when you get up to, like, second gear and then shove it in high... It will pull the front axle off the ground. It's like such a cool, like, it does what these trucks would realistically do with that much weight behind them if you tried to bang shift them. You know what I mean? Yeah. Plus, it's got the Detroit diesel torque. Exactly. 
I wonder if this one is the supercharged one. Well, technically they were all supercharged, but it was okay. just an air scavenger. Oh, okay. Huh. Yeah, they were... Because they were two-stroke diesels, I can't remember right off the top of my head. But the supercharger was just an air scavenger to try and four-speed the turbos. Where are you going? I don't know. I don't know. I need help. I don't know. I literally, I was in high. I was watching the chat. And uh, things happened and went wrong. Oh, jeez. Let's do the thing where I successfully get back onto the road. Okay, thank you. Still need a little bit. Still need a little bit. Still need a little bit. Ah. All right, good now. Thank you. I am so incredibly incredibly grateful to have uh, that 3880 uh, with you driving it as a support rig. Why in the heck does the hood go nuts whenever I get close to it? That doesn't make any sense at all. I think it's just something to do with like phase four. Probably. Because it didn't it didn't do that before. Yeah. By the way, guys, dude, y'all blew through 650 likes on the stream. That's amazing, you guys. Thank you so much. And I'm trying Hi. to... Oh, it was spinning a bit, but now it's, it's rolling in high. I don't think it's necessarily tilted, Risky. I'm looking at it now, and at least on my screen, it looks perfectly level. It might have been, mm. like, I hit a tree or something, and it caused some visual damage, which hasn't synced on my screen. Yeah. And boom! Diversifying the farm. Done. All right. All right. So let's go ahead and shut these guys down. And now we're going to go ahead yeah. and head out to uh, to test some new rigs. So let's go ahead and... Uh, are you good, by the way? You got a good stopping point, Diesel? Oh, yeah, I'm good here. Heck, yeah. So we actually made some really good progress out here. Um, some really good progress on Highway Holland today. But... And let's see, I'm hoping my new optimized hood that was packed on phase four will not do that anymore. Okay, gotcha, 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 gotcha. Yeah, no um, risky. I know, I can see that. It's kind of weird. I'm not going to lie, but. Yeah, I just got to look at it on stream and holy cow, that yeah, looks broken. It, it's uh, it's bugging out for sure. Um, yeah. So let's see. Ah, truck night. Generic mud truck, subbing that thing up. Now this is Glitchworks first um, original truck, I believe. So I'm very excited to test it out and see what it's like because Glitchworks, if you guys aren't familiar, I did a couple of videos of, uh, about a like, month, couple months or so ago um, about his truck tweaks. And they were some really well thought out truck tweaks. And I actually reached out to him um, and said that I, I really digged his stuff. Uh, or dug, dig, digged is not a word, but either dig. way. Um, yeah. Uh, but oh, he does some really, <laughs> yeah, exactly. He does some really good truck tweaks, and I'm really happy to see him expanding into a console friendly mud truck. So we're going to go ahead and give it a shot and see what it's like. Stream hydration first, though. Also, I must just be a sucker for the long frame, big heavy trucks, but did you see that new P12? Uh, the JTT pack? No, this is by DC underscore one sane. Oh, it oh, is enormous. The the DC Insane P12. I haven't used it. It can apparently do 75 inch tires, though. Yeah, that's between that and what look like agricultural tires on it. I had to sub it. Okay, so you've got it. Well, it's literally it's it's freaking zero megs, and so it'll download in an instant. So, so yeah. we have all the trucks we had before, plus we've added the P12 by DC Insane. And we've added the generic mud truck by Glitch. Do you have that one downloaded? Uh, it's currently working on it. This is probably going to take me a few minutes. Okay. Well, I'm going to go ahead and actually test it out real quick just to see what it's like. And then we're going to go actually, ahead and bring it into multiplayer after that. What's up? All right. Uh, one other thing you might want to do is like unsub and resub from Truck Knight. Because oh, if he up that's right. Yeah, because if he updated and it didn't show up on your screen, then... It may not have gone through. Yeah, that's fine. Um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, we'll test out the generic mud truck first. And then remind me when I go back uh, out of here before we load up multiplayer. And I'll just unsub, resub, and we'll be good to go. So let's see. Generic mud truck. Where are you at? Or rather, where did Glitchworks put you? Um, where did Glitchworks put you? All right, Glitch trying to figure out where you're at now what the heck um i'm sure i've passed it now like five times and haven't seen it but like oh boy 
Mud Scout. Lives oh, Mud Scout. That's the code. Uh, like that's the code name for it. Ooh, ooh, mid-engined, freaking root style, supercharged. Oh, dude. Hey, flipped headers too. I love the flipped headers. God, gigantic roots blower, flipped headers, mid-engine. Ho oh, ho ho ho. This is literally the answer to every like mega truck fan on console. Listen to that. <laughs> that idol though. Wow, that idol is amazing. You guys can hear it, right? Well, Holy I can't, but I'll hear it here shortly. Yeah, you'll hear it here shortly. It's got one engine. Uh, it's got, let's throw the off-road gearbox in it. It's got one suspension option. Your current tire options are Super Swampers, BFG Mud Terrains, and uh, Mud Truck Tires, like tractor tires, I guess. I'll leave the Super Swampers on it right now. And, I don't know, uh, we'll do the offline winch. Steelies, mag slot, beadlocks. Yes, weld beadlocks. Yes. Oh my god. Ho 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 ho. Yes. Listen to that. Wow. All right, we need to do a flex test on this thing like pronto. The engine shakes. That's so sick. Wow, this thing is not on consoles yet, but it's fully console friendly and hopefully should make the jump uh, soon, as, as soon as it gets approved. Alright, what's your flex look like? Yo, eh, the flex is pretty sick. Haha, <laughs> uh-oh. The axle doesn't move. Um, I'm sure that's something he will figure out in the future. But, as of right now, the axle does not flex, but you know what? Uh, it's, it's fine. Um... It's his first, like, actual truck mod that isn't a tweak, so... I mean, hey, already mad props. I'm sure it's gonna have some growing pains, but still. Wow! Alright, let's head to the mud and see how she does there. And then I'll remember to go ahead and, uh, resub truck night. God, it's fast! Even with the off-road gearbox, it's freaking quick. Like, you floor it and kick the clutch, and it, like, rockets off into oblivion. It stinks on pavement, but that's, you know, that's just kind of is how it is. The sound, yeah, I know, thing. right? Actually pretty impressed with high range. It's not that fast. It's actually, like, similar to uh, low plus in a lot of other trucks. Hill climb test is going to be nasty. And send. No drama at all. None whatsoever. None whatsoever. I cannot wait to take this thing into multiplayer with Diesel. Especially, like, side by side with the freaking powerhouse. It's gonna be, they're gonna be such great companions for each other. Repair and refuel. Thank you. It didn't knock the fences over. That's disappointing. <laughs> Alright. It's always fun when things break. I know, right? Alright, uh, let's see. What if I change it out to the speedy box? Even then, like, high range is still not all that fast, but, like, it's not, um, it's not crazy. It's just good. Yeah, this thing is just fun. Oh, it's so good. If you're ever having wheel speed issues, you just, like, literally just kick the clutch and it'll downshift a little bit. Um, Ethan Rose says, ahem, any new mods for console besides the F-350? And um, the answer is yes. Um, there are some new uh, updates to existing um, trailers and tweaks, as well as a brand new truck that is based off of the original starting truck from the original spin tires. But um, that Blitzo truck is definitely the one I would recommend getting first, for sure. Uh, let's see. Oh, no worries, Petty43. We will be eagerly awaiting uh, when you get back. All right, now that we've tested this thing out, I'm going to return to the main menu. And I'm going to... Um, and uh, once again, Ethan Rose... Um, I'm super chill about that. I just had to, like, you know how we do. If someone has a message in all caps, we have to, like, you know, we have to shout it. it, it is how it, that's how it goes. But um, let me go back to the mod browser. And I'm going to uh, resub Truck Night. Because of the simple fact that it may or may not be the latest variant. I'm going to go ahead and update it now. And make sure it is the latest variant. 
And so, all right, Diesel. So remember, we have the generic mud truck added, and we also added that new uh, stretched P12. Okay. I'm still waiting. I have the P12 downloaded, and I'm still waiting for the generic mud, tr mud truck to finish. Oh, there we go. As I say it, it finishes. That timing, though. All right. So, yep. so do that and do that. All right. Um, Now we're ready to kick off, I think. Okay, so browser, truck night is on. It's good to go. All right, new game, custom scenarios. Bootleg Hallows, that's a new map by Big Dubs that we need to try out. Maybe not uh, today, but we'll see. Uh, Trucks Max Pack is back. Heck yes! Dude, I'm so happy it's back. Let's see, Amir is trolling me so much. I need to go to that highway map. Dude, heck yeah, you do. All right, this should be... Oh, there's Truck Night in America region. All right, select. And... Um, um I'm going to delete my hard mode run for that. What's wrong, bud? So apparently my scenario is invalid and can't be uploaded. What? That's what I'm thinking. Uh, I would say begin with a game restart. Yeah, okay. I will... Let me go into that and delete that one that I started. I'm trying to load and... into Truck Night right now and... Oh, wait. Your scenario is not valid. Cannot be uploaded. Log file, documents, snow runner base, logs, dot, mod map, error, dot, txt. <laughs> yeah. Well, let's, uh, since I have just restarted, it'll take a minute. Yeah, let's um, see what this does. Let's see what happens. Because if not, we'll go to either, like, West Georgia or definitely Stadium because we know it works um, yeah. on the PTS. Frank messed up. Oof, apparently. Um, and hey, again, no worries at all, Ethan Rose. And what's up, Aiden Brock? I see you chilling out out there in the chat saying hi. Once again, Ethan Rose, um, it's not uh, it's not like a rule or anything. It's just kind of like a um, Frank, uh, Frankie borked it, yeah, apparently. But um, yeah, Ethan, it's just one of those things that we've been doing forever. It's like if someone types a, a message in all caps in the chat, we just we scream it. It's just kind of what we do. It's not like a rule or anything. It's just something fun that we do. All right, uh, while you do that, I'm thinking that it's probably going to do it again. So, um, I'm going to look up Stadium, and I'm going to go ahead and get it turned on, because I know it works. Yeah, I'll do the same here, and right. should be able to load in. Okay, I've turned on Stadium. I'm also going to turn on the Mudcat. Yeah, okay, and we can check out Don's new paint job. Yes, okay, Mod Browser. I need to figure out what map is causing me an issue right now, because obviously Stadium shows up as letters and numbers, but... What's the it's uh, 4460, 40, 445, 665. That's stadium. Four, okay. Right. All right. The other one that I had was TNB Trails, but I've turned it off. So 44, 56, 65. That is stadium. All right. Deleting truck night and loading in stadium. So sometimes we have to, uh, oh, God, Risky's like, Franklin. <laughs> oh, my God. I love it. Let's see. So I'm just gonna retain that Hummer. Whoops. And... Exactly. Oh my God. Now that ever. Now that I said what I said about the caps, people are like, uh, people are like, is Snowrunner fun? Yes. <laughs> oh my God. That's great. Let's see. Just looking at your. Uh, uh, I see what you posted. It looks like you got a Forza Horizon wing on there. Boy, I tell you what. All right. Spinning this guy around, loaded into Stadium Super Trucks. Why are you not spinning? Okay, either way. Uh, retain, storage, sell all my DLC. And retain my Hummer, and return to main menu, and boot up multiplayer. Uh, Aiden Barak says, new mods. New mods. Um, the latest mod that I uh, recommend checking out on consoles is the Blitzo truck, which is... A console-friendly, console-now-playable, um, and fully-friendly and usable Ford OBS. So we're going to actually go into co-op now. 44, 56, 65, a.k.a. Um, Super Truck Stadium. Loading up. Hopefully, it doesn't kick me off the connection. Kazuki uh, SU, no worry about it. It's fine. <laughs> yeah. uh, it's fine. Hmm. Yeah, that was me, like, story time of, like, me going, this is fine, uh, was basically, like, so I was on my way back, I was traveling, this was, like, two or three years ago, I want to say, actually, now, probably three years ago, long before, like, the current, you know, uh, 
situation around the around the world let's say um i was traveling back from sweden okay so i was on my way back from sweden to atlanta and i had a plane change in amsterdam and something happened with the flight getting out of sweden i think it was like the runway was iced over and they had to de-ice the runway and it made us take off super late so it's fine whatever so we get to amsterdam and I'm sitting there in Amsterdam, and hey, Diesel during the game, heck yeah. So yeah, I'm sitting there in Amsterdam in the airport, and I hear over the loudspeaker, flight so-and-so is departing. And then I, I, I go, wait a minute, that was my flight to Atlanta. And so now I'm like, I'm sitting there in the Amsterdam airport, my flight to Atlanta has long left at this point, and I'm sitting there, I'm like, this is fine. This is fine, <laughs> but it was one of those things where fortunately, um, fortunately, because of the fact that my other flight was delayed, the air, the, the airline actually got me another flight the next day and put me up in a hotel. So all was well at the end of the day. And like, I didn't have to like, you know, book an extra flight on my own. They literally like, they sorted it out, got everything squared away and we were all good to go. And Kazuki yes, you, you better believe the Blitzo truck is out on consoles. Heck yeah, my dude. Beans the bubblehead doggo, right? All right, I'm buying myself a powerhouse rear steer. I think this time, OPLSX. I was building. I was just building the non rear steer. Oh, were you really? Oh, heck yeah! Well, it's gonna be rear steer versus non rear steer, I guess. Um, let's see. OP mud tractor tot actually. OP mud tractor dually boys with the spare and Murica. And I probably won't run the rear whips on this one, but I will run the underglow, the spare fuel, and powerhouse stickers. And we'll run it in white and we'll run custom r, &R card. All right, this is my first truck. Oh my God, it's so loud. Oh my God, it is so loud. Jesus. Well, I'm sure the stream can hear that one. Oh, there he goes. Yeah, yeet. I'm getting it, I'm getting it, I'm getting it, I'm getting it. How far can I go with these mud duels? Oh, about that far. <laughs> Ow. Now. Okay, I just messed up my truck a bit, so I'll be right back. You know what? So did I. Uh, ah, it's only a tiny bit of suspension damage. It ain't worth it. So, I'm going to make my way back into the garage. By the way, guys, I cannot tell you how good it feels to have a new controller with no more issues. Oh, my God. I don't have to worry about it disconnecting on me. Don't have to worry about a freaking wire. I'm just, like, I'm so happy about it. Like, it was so worth it. Like, yes, that old uh, controller was nostalgic, but holy smokes, it's, it's nice having a proper one. All right, I'm going to buy one more thing, and then I'm also going to do that max rank task so we can buy whatever. You know what I mean? Yeah. All right, I'm going to get... There we go. I'm going to get me race truck. Yes, I love me race truck. Me speedy speed boy. I love this thing in, like, even the default orange. Whoa! God, it whips around fast. Did you get the Bluetooth one? Um, yeah, so I got... Oh, hello. Um, I got the, um... Just the wireless USB uh, Xbox One controller. Yeah, nothing too crazy. But I do really like the electric green color. Like, it's actually a really cool color. I've never had one in this color before. There's another one for my controller collection. Max rank and max money, boys. I'm going to go ahead and set this, uh, set this truck at the start line of the racetrack. And we'll be good to go. Do you not like spending money or something? No, I just... I like spending money on cars and trucks. I also like spending money on, like, PC parts. But, like, you gotta understand, my old, like, wired Xbox 360 controller was, like, it's not even that I didn't want to spend the money to buy a new one. Like, I actually probably buy more controllers than I need to. But, like, that one was just so nostalgic to me because I had used it on PC for so many years. All right. So, let that guy chill yeah, right I'll be, there. I'll be right out of the garage, but you gotta see Lime's... Uh, Mudcat here. Lime's Mudcat. Oh, yep. the new... Yes. So, I've seen the new paint job. I just haven't played around with any of the new features yet. Did he add some new features to it? 
Uh, that I don't know just yet. But at the moment, I'm trying to prep mine. So... I'm also prepping my, um... Oops, no, oh, I don't boy. Want... There we go. We'll throw the, uh, we'll... Ooh, ooh. We'll throw the MTs on this one. Yeah, right now I'm prepping the... Oh, 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 all right. I'm prepping the new, uh, generic mud truck. Which it, I mean, it's legit. Hey, Rift, welcome back. Um, let's see. I have a Bluetooth one, too. TBH is much better than a stupid wire when I'm trying to get... Trying to test stuff. Oh, God, yeah. Oh, God, yeah. Oh, that's awesome, uh, SNG. Whoop. It sounds so good. Where are you, by the way, Diesel? Should be right next to you. You can't see me? Oh, you're in the... Oh, I just wasn't looking. Hey! Oh, okay. That's what Don's new, uh... That's what Don's new paint job. So do we want to race the Mudcat versus... Which truck first? Well, I think we had decided we were gonna do the, um the new generic mud truck versus the powerhouse on the obstacle course. And it should right. be a really fun one. Let's see. Colton Hagen, when are you going to PA again? Um, well, honestly, like, I don't know when I'm going to, uh, to Pennsylvania again because, like, um, I used to have uh, family up there, but they've since moved, and I haven't really done any road trips up that way in a long time. But, like, it was interesting. I actually did, like, if you look on my Instagram, I did... Um, that is my did a really cool like, line of pictures from a uh, from a road trip that I did in the M3. Let's see if you guys don't have any private mods, I'll join. Uh, do we have any private ones on right now? I don't think we do. Actually, no. The, the generic 3500 is public. Yeah, give her a try, Risky. I think the F450. No, the F450 is out there too. Oh, Twisted Throttle Outdoors. What's up, man? How's it going out there, my dude? All right. You ready, Diesel? Oh, yeah. I'm ready. You're in charge of that countdown. It's going to be the Glitchworks right. Mud Truck versus uh, Risky's Powerhouse. Okay. Three, two, one. Let's go. Dump the clutch. Up. Oh, Ow. you... Well, we hit in midair. Oh my god. Also, apparently I don't have a high gear, but that's fine. I will make you with auto get out of the way. Okay. I don't know how you Whoa! I don't know what the heck that was, but it was nuts. Oh, I got you, Colton. Alright. All good, my dude. Oh my god! Heard a good crash back there. Bro, I don't have. I don't an have offline an offline winch? winch. How? Oh, oh, he makes you select it. Ah, all right. Let all me right. resume from where I crashed. Uh, we'll just bypass that first um, that Oops. first obstacle and we'll restart like right over here. All right. Yeah, we'll start like right here. You chill with that? Yeah, I'm good. All right, you go ahead and I'll follow you because you were already in front. Okay. Whoops. Boink. My bad. Whoa! You didn't even touch me on my screen. Oh my god. Oh jeez. This thing, like, it has a problem keeping the front end down sometimes. It's not a bad thing, it's just like an observation. Holy cow. Ow. I did see that, Colton Hagen. It's wild. Miscusi. Closer match than I thought. Honestly, so did I. Ah! Don't flip it here. Don't flip it here. Don't flip it here. I'm going to jump this. Oh, yeah. That was beautiful. Getting it. Getting it. Getting it. Getting it. Oh, that boy going to flip. Oh, my God. I am blown away by the performance of this suspension over the logs. I mean, that one was just kind of driver error on my part, but wow. Uh oh, nope, nope, really nope, 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 nope. This thing can do handstands, man. Like legit axle stands. All right, he says he's downloading generic truck and Blitzo right now, Risky says. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Make a run for it. Ooh. It's a little ripper, this thing. 
especially for not having a high gear with this uh, with this gearbox. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Just got here. What's up, Jenny Cole? I see you out there in the chat. We are on PC right now, but we are using mods that are fully console friendly and will be making their way to console soon. Also, if you're just joining the stream, make sure to look at your console mod browser and check out the new Blitzo truck, which is a console um, usable Ford OBS flatbed. And again, it is on console right now as well as a recreation of the original blue truck from the OG Spin Tires that is also available on consoles now as well. Those are both new as of today. Not bad on the landing. Let's see how Diesel's doing back. Oh God, Diesel's coming. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. And front flip. Yikes, Almost. all right. I've gotta say though, um, like while I'm sure he'll figure out the animations a little bit later on, uh, Glitch did an awesome job with the tuning on this thing. The tuning is great. It's so good, in fact. Whoop. All right, getting after it. Also, we have to check out that, that stretched P12 on 75s. But yeah, definitely need to do that. Oh, no. Oh, God. Oh. I went for a slight uh, spin cycle right there. Ever so slight. Oh, my dude. Oh, no. Blizz. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. No. No. Grab my front axle, somebody. Ah. Okay. All right. Let's go. Go, 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 go. I'm caught on something. Oh, maybe not anymore. Once again, he passed me. Full on driver error. That is not the truck's fault. Dude, on my screen, you are so broken. That suspension is freaking stiff. I know, right? I hope it gets a little bit more flexy uh, as time goes on. I also broke my suspension, and ironically, it's now a lot more flexible. I also broke my <laughs> fuel tank, which um, I don't know if I can make it to the end now, but we'll find out. Tucker Bellows, what is up, man? I see you saying hi. Okay, and hold on. Oops, I can repair you, I think. I have a few parts. Oh, good. I am Air. slammed. Hey, That's thank all you I for got. that. All right. I've at least got a little bit of suspension points left. Oh, you're going for the right yes. hand side. Yes. Okay. I got to be careful here, though. What are we doing now? We are racing the new console-friendly generic mud truck by Glitchworks against Risky's Powerhouse, my dude. What's up, Rashad? I see you saying hi out there. Those tires look really small. They are a little small. Get it, get it, get it. Oh, no. Save that just ever so narrowly. Fully damaged up the suspension again. Not gonna worry about it. Yo, he's right behind me. This is down to the wire. ETA on Mod Z450 release. Um, we're not quite sure yet. As soon as he gets the unbranded um, body parts done, though, I'm sure it would be submitted for ow, 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 ow. Uh, submitted for approval on consoles, and then it just has to pass testing. Go! Tie. Hi. Not on my screen. Oh, really? What was it on your screen? You won? I actually won. Hey, I'm not surprised because that desync do be real, though. That desync do be freaking real. Yo, you guys are about to blow through that 700 likes mark on the stream. That is so incredible, dudes. Thank you so much. All right, where is that? Okay. Oh, I see it. This is the insane P12. And, oh God, S power to weight rating. <laughs> oh, oh God. Advanced special Good. gearbox. Go to the tires and see what Raise happens. High. Look at the camera angle. Good Lord, 75 inch tires. Will this, yo, you guys blew through that 700 likes mark on the stream. Thank you so much, you guys. Seriously, thank you so much. Do you think this thing would make it around the racetrack? Uh, we can sure find out. Oh my god. Oh my god. The 75 inch off road tires are like, they're stupid. They're like, oh, yeah, in they're the best way possible. Nuts. But my god. You can do Hummer H2 tires in 75. Oh my god. You can do 75 inch tires. You can do a 75 inch version of the P512 tires. Oh, ho, 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 ho. But I'm not even into the mud tires yet. Oh. All right. 
I'm gonna go ahead and buy those for now. And Kazuki Kazuki TC, I love your strip. Thank you so much, Fire Chief, coming to consoles. Well, I'd see you on that one, bro. But let me see. Super heavy mud tires. One, two, Voron tires. Yeah. What's up, Diesel? I said, oh, man, he's only got the super heavies in 73 inch. Uh, does he really? Oh, man. Yep. He's got, oh, my God, 75 inch Apache tires. No. Oh, you want to know how to make this thing so OP, like right out of the gate? Z 75 inch ZIKZ 605R tires. Oh, oh boy. my God. What's up, Skull Nation 02? Welcome back to the stream. Thank you so much for hanging out. But I'm going to do the 770G uh, in 75s. Good God. Advanced heavy. Spare wheels. This is like... Oh, my God. This is so dumb in, like, all the right ways. But, my God, this is so dumb. Holy smokes. One of the new console mods, uh, the newest console mod that you guys can check out as of today is the Blitzo Truck, which is a console-friendly Ford OBS available on Xbox and PlayStation as of today. There is also a brand new uh, recreation of the starter truck from the original Spin Tires, also once again available on both Xbox and PlayStation as of today. Definitely check both of those out. You guys will not be disappointed. So going back into frame add-ons, I'm going to put on the short flatbed. And uh, I cannot wait to show this thing to you. Oh, good lord. Good lord, this is so bad. I mean, in a good way, but my god. Twin horns for sure. Exhaust. Uh, side welded, yes, because it looks amazing. And whatever like combination of colors you might want, they're all here. I like the default one because it matches the... Um, it actually matches the cat wheels quite well. Beans on the dash. And we'll do pine forest up there. I like that one. And oh yeah, we'll do the wild wolf on the dash. Good God. I'm definitely gonna throw. Yo, Gage Master 08 with the 199 Super Chats. Been following since Spin Tires. Thank you for your videos. Dude, thank you so much for hanging out at all the videos and the streams. I genuinely appreciate it, my dude. And once again, also thank you for that 199 Super Chat. I sincerely appreciate it, my dude. Um, and Diesel, Risky is asking for an invite. Um, I don't know if you have him on Epic, do you? Uh, yeah, I do, actually. Hang on just a second. Oh, really? Awesome. Okay. I'll do the Bulldog on the front. Oh, that's so good. Ooh, actually the Saber Tooth. Oh my god! Oh, and look at this! Look at this monster! Wow! And let's see if Risky can join. Wow! Those spare tires aren't going to do anything. Ah, don't worry about it. They're fine. If I pop a tire, I can still use them. I'm coming. I'm just sort of beating up the TUZ Warthogs here. Um, so high through mud pit number two now high through mud well okay mud pit number three it can do high but it struggles a little bit but through mud pits one and two like it is i mean technically it's making it through mud pit number three as well in high um i'm running the 770g tires with the singles in the front and the duels in the back what are you running uh the super the 73 inch super heavies uh okay. super heavy two okay how are you getting on well, so far, high gear, haven't lifted yet, and I, is it, it's sort of bogging here. It seems a little slower than mine was going, but we'll see. I have been having a good day, Noah Evans. How about you, dude? Yeah, I've been having a blast today, man. Like, just hanging out on stream with all of you guys. Like, it's always so much fun. And uh, Ethan Lee, well, you can actually find uh, find that out and uh, just anything else you might want to know by the link in the description box down below where you can find my Instagram, actually. But um, also, let's see, tug of war between that and Monster Max 2, bro, maybe in the future. And let's see, Stanton, what is up out there in the chat? Why are you not streaming on Twitch? Because I prefer streaming on YouTube. I know that might sound weird, but like, I genuinely prefer streaming on YouTube. Dude, this horn sounds so bad. <laughs> yeah, if, if there was one thing, I don't know if the creator's out there watching or listening in some way, but Swap if he the is, horn. Please, please change the horn. Yeah. Let's see. Is it faster in auto with the um, with the uh, the fine tune gearbox? Well, the fine tune gearbox seems to have a slightly faster high range, and okay. apparently, 
Apparently it's faster in auto through here. I haven't lifted yet. Bruh. Or slowed down yet. Oh my god. This thing is so silly. Like, in every sense of the world. But, like, the crazy part about it is that if you were a, like, an insane enough fabricator, you could make this truck happen with tires so, this big. So the fine-tuned gearbox works in reverse, too. Ah, cool. All right, I'm going to go see if this thing can do the track jump. I doubt it, but I'm going to find out anyway. You made a pile of TUZ warthogs, bud. Here, I can fix that. Hang on, one. just a minute. Oh god, oh god, oh god, here he comes. He's gonna fix this. <laughs> All right. Actually, I'm curious now. I cannot climb up them, but I can push them slightly. All right, now we're about to find out if it can actually make that, um, let's see, right, Latasha Pate? Exactly. Um, Risky says, I didn't receive anything, huh? All right, hold on. Let me try again, Risky. And if not Risky, it just means the Epic Invite system is broken again. That's why Diesel and I don't use it. So, Risky, if this doesn't work, uh, start a start a session, a, a uh, offline session on Stadium Super Trucks, and then join off of my name or TC's. Yeah, there you go. Sent another invite. All right, here we go. Oh yeah, heck no, that ain't gonna work. Nope. I I can see the results from here. Lawn dart status. Um, I'm actually gonna let this guy chill right over here. And uh, let's see. Gold Daniels, what's up my dude? And you bet. Let's see, the, the uh, 350 OBS is good in level three mud. Dude, it's actually a lot better in mud than people uh, might think. I'm gonna shut this guy down and I'm gonna get in my CORR uh, race truck. Why don't you grab a CORR and we'll hit the racetrack. Actually, I'll tell you what. I'll bring my other race truck. Uh oh, what's that? Well, I'm gonna warm up You'll that see. first jump first. Boom! Oh, I love this thing. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, redo this thing real quick. Just got it all repaired, ready to go. And J Dalton Todd says new console mods question mark and oh hi. Um, the latest okay. console mod as of today that you're definitely gonna want to check out is a OBS Ford. Uh, with a flatbed called the Blitzo truck that is available on consoles right now, along with a full recreation of the original blue truck from the starting level of the original spin tires that you guys should definitely check out as well. Both of those are available right now on the console mod browser on PlayStation and Xbox. Let's ease it forward just a little bit. All right. This countdown is all on you. I mean, for me, it's like, what is this? Long travel square body race truck against brand new Duramax. I think the long travel square body is going to win, but, you know. <laughs> well, I might be able to brute force my way through it. That usually solves a lot of problems. Yeah, Mike. But anyway. Build Lime Step 450. Right. Ooh, very soon, Colton Lacey. That is definitely something we could get on with. All right. All right. Three, two, one. Let's go. Getting after it. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, I got a little out of shape. Oh, Ron Dart. Ow. Oh. Dude, this thing had a tank slapper going real bad. And I'm backwards. How backwards? Oh, that backwards. Uh, PTS, Risky. Oh, 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 oh. Let's go! Come on. What's up, Gage? I see you saying hi out there in the chat. Thank you so much for stopping by. There you go, there you go, there you go. Ooh, diving in. God, this truck handles so well. I heard some smashy crashy behind me. I don't know how you're doing back there, but... God, I'm doing just fine. I don't know where the smashy crashy. Okay, now I did smash something. Uh oh. God, worry, guys, I love, love how this suspension handles. It's amazing, amazing. See, oh, that's why the invite didn't work. Oh, were you trying to join us on PTS off of live game? Yeah, that's why. We're on PTS because we don't like the live game frame lag issues. But PTS has already gotten the fix for that. And so once it gets proofed on PTS uh, enough for the devs to be happy with it, then they can push that to live game, thankfully enough. Julian and Mr. Walker, what is up? Can you make more videos with the highway map? Oh, coming soon, my dude. Coming very soon. Stay tuned. Oh, no. Oh, God. It, 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 uh. Yep. God, it's so good. That so, suspension. yeah, this truck has a, a fair bit of power. 
Oh, it's got... I'm sure it's got a lot more power than I have. I mean, you're putting down so much torque out of that Duramax, but, like, I mean, I've got the suspension travel for days, and this thing handles like a machine. I'm taking the high line. I never take hey, the high line. I, I literally never take the high line in this truck, so... Oh, yeah, Rifts, this suspension is Oops. so smooth. So I just cleared the guardrail. Uh, okay. I am, uh, I'm waiting for you on the... Oh, I see what happened. Oh, dear yeah. God. I hit the jump because I took a look over at the stream and uh, had an issue. Yeah, I had an issue. So let's see. Grievance Sage, what is up, man? And he's like... Holy hell sauce, there's no dang way a fella could do phase four in hard mode. It's infuriating, and just the first four bridge side jobs require 7,000 gallons of fuel. Yeah, I'd believe it. Oop. Come on, come on. I better make this. I better make this. Okay, I almost did. There we go. It's not almost. I actually did make it, but I let him get ahead of me, so that's not good. So I'm really impressed with Fred's uh, tuning there. Um, with tuning and power output on the CLRR. It's because so he... good. Yeah, he's keeping up with a Lime's dually. Yeah, well, not only that, but, like, the He's smooth, actually beating it. The smooth suspension performance is just, like, there's nothing that feels out of place. I mean, if you compare this to, like, some of Fred's first mods, holy crap. And the thing is, what I love about Fred is that, like, the dude doesn't quit. I mean, people ate him up in the comments when he first, like, started releasing trucks they were like oh this suspension tuning is terrible and this this stinks and that stinks and he didn't care he just kept on going and that's why we have trucks like this you know and that just goes to yep. show if you're starting out making mods don't let somebody tell you that your mods uh that your mod stinks because guess what they're not making mods so keep doing you and keep making mods and eventually you're gonna get to the point where you can turn out like crazy crazy performing trucks yeah, and by no means was I throwing shade at Limes with the comment about the dually. I no. love this truck. No, 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 no. I mean, Limes tuning is awesome, but, like, that was more like a compliment to both Limes and Fred. You know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, cross the line. It does not like to stop on pavement. It's got, like, bus brakes on pavement. Apparently, your brakes are worse. But, um... That's my braking zone. All right, truck storage. I'm going to go ahead and sell the CORR, and I'm going to pick myself up a upgraded F450, an upgraded Limes F450, and I am down to race your Mudcat. So I'm going to build myself a very, very wild F450. If you build yourself a wild Mudcat, so... Uh, I actually have mine waiting in the wings. Do you? Yep. I think I might be ready to go. Uh, give me just one moment to get this thing prepped. And uh, I know for a fact that uh, Diesel, unless he's looking at the stream, does not understand what is coming for him. <laughs> so I will say this. The Mudcat is really fast, and mm -hmm. apparently it hits like a runaway bus because I just tagged your P12 and sent it skidding. Uh-huh. So he made the ah. monster tires bigger. Uh, <laughs> hmm. A lot bigger. Like, a lot bigger. I don't know if the physics of this thing can actually keep up with how big the tires are now. Definitely worth finding out. Oh, yeah. Also on bulletproofed engine and uh, fast transmission. Nine speed. Same here. The only thing is, I'm going to flip over and tank on my side. Somebody in the chat was like, Hulk truck. And honestly, I agree with you. What new console mods are there? Well, you can definitely check out the new Blitzo truck, which is the console-friendly OBS Ford. That is on uh, PlayStation and Xbox now. And there's also the... Oh, I'm not going to be able to use this thing. There's also... <laughs> due to the top heaviness. But there's also a... Um, uh, on consoles now, there's a mod truck, which is a remake of the starter truck from the original Spin Tires, which is also super, super, super cool. And I definitely recommend checking it out. Yeah, I'll save that for a Monster Jam map. I'm going to rework this thing just a little bit for something like that's slightly more, uh, oh, I don't know, um, usable. All right, let's see. That's really high. 
those are really high. I might actually, you know what I'm going to do? I think I figured it out. I think I figured it out. Okay, yeah. I got it. I got it. I got the approach down now. All right, I'm going to do some fairly large tractor tires with the standard suspension, but I'm going to lift it. So that way, I've got a usable center of gravity. I love this truck. God, also, I love this truck. The Mudcat is so easy to control wheelies in. Oh, I know. It's so good. You're definitely more along the lines of a mud truck, and I'm definitely more along the lines of a SEMA truck slash mega truck. Basically, a SEMA truck that's effective. Also, yeah. I love the design work on that thing. DB and Don absolutely just getting down with that design work. Yeah. I had absolutely no idea what to expect coming into this, but I love this paint job too. I'm going to turn my green lights on. Let's see. What is the new mod for console? Once again, Isaiah, it is a new Ford OBS along with a remake of the starter truck from the original spin tires. Check them both out on the mod browser on Xbox and PlayStation and make sure you sort by latest update. All right, Diesel. I'm going to hold on one second and see your lights in daytime. I know, right? That's the crazy part. But let's see that countdown, my dude. All right. Three, two, one. Swing let's go. And dump the clutch. I love how I can literally... This thing really is Hulk truck. I can see my freaking lights in daytime. Getting down. Woo. This thing just gets down. Oh, no. I'm going to send it. Oh, God. Oh, jumped right over me. I'm good. And cleared the other He's one. He's good. Is that truck on PC? Oh uh, yeah, it's actually um, it's actually in development, and there's a console-friendly variant that is going to be uh, that is going to be in the works very soon as well. So you guys, at some point, will be able to get this thing on consoles. And up and over. Oh, he's right behind me. I'm going to blind him. I'm going to blind him. I'm going to smoke him out. But the you guys are about to blow through that 750 likes mark of the stream. Thank you so much. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my- Whoa! Almost worked at it. <laughs> it almost worked. Yep. Let's see. Go, 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 go. Oh, I tipped. Did you? Yep. Oh no! Alright, make my way over. There we go. There we go. Oh. Oh. Easy does it. Nice and easy. Ooh. Full send. Full sendies. Oh god, full. Ooh. Full boink. Yeah. All right, here's a full send. Full sendies for chicken tendies. Oh god. Oh. Ooh, oh god. Okay, I have no idea how that works, that but I'll take it. First front flip. All right. Glad one of us was recording for that. Wow! Okay, we're gonna have to make a stream highlight out of that. Holy crap, that was so nuts. Wow! Alright, I'm heading down the hill now. Come on. What is up, Ryan? I see you out there in the chat. And actually, there's another Ryan. There's multiple Ryans in the chat saying hi. What's good, Ryans? That Ryan squad. When's the relay coming to consoles? We don't know the exact date yet, but hopefully really soon. Alright, I'm launching speed and power full on Clarkson approach. Oh, jeez. Buried my front axle, but bounced it, so I'm okay. I don't know what happened to you. Did you break? Uh, no, I didn't. I got a little hung up in the rocks, and I had to take care of something in the stream real quick. Oh, I got you. I got you. I got you. Yeah, and now I tipped again. Let's see. Oh, oh. <laughs> I just made a tree completely disappear. Let's see. Hey, Gage, welcome back, man. Welcome back to the stream, man. Welcome home from school. Dude, I bet you're glad to be home, right? Always, okay, always now, Monday things. Now I'm in reverse. Getting Why are turned you around. in reverse? Uh, science. I'm in reverse for science. It's fine. Yep. Okay. I'm just going to clear this. Let's see. Um, I don't know if you know me, but I've been around since 200,000 subs. That's freaking legit, bro. You're the legend, man. I'm not saying I'm a legend, but you're the freaking legend. Let's see, what are the name of the mods on consoles? Uh, the newest mods on consoles as of right now are the Blitzo Truck, which is a OBS Ford, and it's on Xbox and PlayStation. And there's also a um, a new RNG truck, 
by Ranger, which is a recreation of the classic spin tires starter truck available on consoles as well, as well as numerous updates to trailer packs and uh, truck tweaks and maps as well. Holy cow, holy cow, holy cow. Oh, I did what you did, but I didn't make it all the way back over. Yike. <laughs> Yeah, I'm just gluing my foot to the floor and hoping for the best. That's kind of what I'm doing as well. And it didn't work. Oh, no. Poor Diesel. <laughs> I'm just okay. sending. Oh! I almost didn't make that turn. Oh, dude, that's awesome, Kane. Thank you so much. Let's see. I want Lives to make an old L400. Oh, that would be cool. Like a, like a retro L400. You could go back in time. Like, says this one is a newer one, then he could go back in time and do, like, an OBS L400. That'd be so sick. Or even further what? back and do, like, the 78. Yes, that'd be awesome. He could literally complete the entire L400 line. I'm surprised he doesn't call him, like, the L450 or the L350. Oh, no. Uh -oh. I fell off. Oh, no. Do you need an assist? I'll come back and do a heck of an assisty. Uh-oh. Let's see. Oh, Rifts is in the chat like, there's two people here that obviously need to learn how to drive! And I'm like, okay. Well, I... Uh, come on. You know this thing took high in the deep mud next to the concrete barriers and took off? That's freaking crazy. What? Yep. I was coming back to help, but, you know, I mean, I guess we're, we're good to yep. go now. Full send. Right. Hey, jumped into me. I did not mean to do that. All right, here, I'm handicapping myself for that one. All right, right from here, I'm just gonna dump it in high. Three, two, one, let's go. Go, go! Oh no. Oh. Did you do the same thing I did? Pretty much, yep. Yeah. Oh, why am I? God, get in the right gear. No. Oh my God, get in the right gear and go, 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 go. Yes. But I'll tell you what, I may have been slightly unfair to you with that jump. Oh my God. Just like, gonna sunbathe here. In terms of, in terms of honor, I'm calling that a tie. <laughs> like, All right, that sounds for fair. Real. I can accept that. Killer1115 says, the first video I ever watched of yours was seven years ago. Wow. Well, thank you, Aiden Kua. I really appreciate that. What are some good mods to get? Bro, like, there's a ton. Definitely recommend um, going on your console mod browser and sorting by latest updates um, if you want to see not only the newest trucks, but also the newest updates to existing trucks. Um, big, like, top tip for you on that one. Callum and Levi and Thomas, what is good, all you guys? Thank you so much for coming and hanging out. All right, so our next battle is actually going to be... Ooh, it should be something fun. What do you think? I'm going to let you pick the next battle, actually. And I'm also um, going to let you pick what course, whether it's race course or um, or obstacle course. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. This, yeah, this is a tough one because I already have planned what I'm going to drive. Oh, do you? Oh, yep. Do you know? So how about the R&R &R truck versus what I'm currently in right now? The R&R. &R, oh, the powerhouse? Yeah. Okay. Well, good news for you is I have one of those, I think. Yeah, it's sitting right here next to me. Oh, it is? Okay. Let me sell the F450 at the moment. Oh, okay. There we go. Oh, boy. Oh, this was that yeah. double dually that I never drove. What's up, Tom Roy? I see you out there in the Santa Cruz Reyes. What's going on? I'm pretty sure you're going to walk me, but at the same time, it should be a fun... A fun race. Do you want me to put the lower powered engine in this thing just to, and the non OP tires to try to even it out? Actually, I think it'll be a good battle either way. I'm going to put the R engine and the non OP tires. All right, so this Well, is... these tires are actually rated as OP because they have, like, excellent grip on every surface, even ice. But at the same time, I should probably handicap myself anyway because I'm smaller, lighter, and rear steerable. Okay, fair so, enough. So, Mace BMX, what's good, man? Welcome back, and welcome back, Hayden Burden as well. And Jonah, what is up? All right. Okay. In here for your countdown. Okay. Three, two, 
one, let's go. This thing is so much slower with the non-OP engine, the non-OP tires. Oh, jeez. Oh, God, I'm stalling out. Oh, jeez. Same here, actually. And I might be stuck. Here. I don't think you're going to move me. I help in good faith. Oh, God, uh, you're just moving me. Yeah, this was not going to work. Yeah, apparently. powerhouse go burr. All right, I tell you what. Alternate plan. Alternate plan. Do you want me to stay in the same truck? Yeah, you can stay in the same truck and just you know for what? my Why not? own sanity, I'm going back to OP tires because uh, I yeah. think I might need them for whatever it is you're bringing out. Yeah, I, you're going to need them. Okay. All right. And go back to OP engine while you're at it. I went back to OP engine and tires. So let me get these going here. Yeah, All righty. Let's see, gear has for life. Howdy, my dude. Wait, someone was talking about a dirt bike mod? I don't know about that, man. We'll need to see if that's like actually a freaking thing. Ooh, welcome back, Eli Dalton. I see you out there in the chat. Mod browser, mod browser is glitching out like, like crazy, Risky says. I'll have to join you all another day. Thanks for the invites, though. Hey, no worries, man. We're always down to have you. Um, just we have to make sure the freaking game works. Yeah. Trust me, it was. It has been a battle just getting it to work for the two of us. So, um, Eli Outlaw, Heather, what's going on, y'all? I see you guys out there in the chat. Holy crap! I didn't even realize we. What you know, you're having a absolute blast of a stream when you go a half an hour past the three hour mark and don't even realize it. We've been live for three and a half hours. I didn't even know. I didn't even realize. What? Wow. Yeah, I, I had just seen that, and I thought you knew about it, so... No, not anything. until now. What's up, Timmy? I see you out there in the chat. Yeah, this will definitely probably be our last race, but once again, thank you all so much for hanging out with us. Like, we had a freaking blast. I know I did. I hope Diesel did, and with, oh, yeah. without, like... Oh, my God. Like, with that being said, I hope each and every one of you guys had an incredible time, too. So, you know what we're going to do? We're going to send off this stream with a battle between a Cat Eye Duramax Duleon Mud Tires and Powerhouse on the obstacle course. Count us down, Diesel. Three, two, one. Here we go. Let the clutch and go. Yeah, you, oh, oh, jeez. Well, that went well. <laughs> yeah, it went well for me too. I'm on my roof as well. Yeet it. Oh, we will, Valerie. Don't you freaking worry. I have a feeling you have there more gears go. than me and that you're faster than me. There's Rans and their new console mods. Yes, there are two new trucks on consoles today. One is a remake of the original uh, Spin Tire starter truck. The other one is a OBS Ford with a flatbed called the Blitzo truck, and it's available on, or I should say both are available on Xbox and PlayStation as of today, along with various um, truck tweaks and map updates. Jump the game. What is going on out there in the chat? Thank you for saying hi, my dude. Stuffed right, the front bumper right into the logs and took only one point of engine damage. Oh my god. Oh, I spun around on the logs. What the heck? Not have that be a thing. I can't go in a straight line. Whoa. Totally Maybe. planned that. Uh, yeah. Maybe me taking the slow approach right there was the better idea. David, what is going on out there in the stream? Sent it. Oh, just barely made it, but sent it. This thing squats and takes right off. Oh, I know. I gotta be so careful with my rear steer plus, like, driving it high. I also have no idea how I cleared most of this course in high gear. I'm trying well, to do the same, and it's mostly working, but just now I had to go back into automatic. Takes the heck off. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Whoa. How many, to do that. How many barrel rolls was that? Like three? Uh, that, that was at least three. I was going to say three, maybe four. Yeah, I am turtled. This is strategic uh, strategic blocking right now. Yeah. Unintended, but I'll take it. Yeah. By the way, you guys are closing in on the 800 likes mark on the stream. Thank you all so freaking much. That is so wild, you guys. Thank you seriously, guys, so much. Uh-oh. Oh. I am actually in a lot of trouble here from the look of things. I mean, can you not find a... Finally oh, got a good enough one point. Yeah, I'm staying go. here That's just it. in case. Yo, Jacob, what's up, man? I've been watching since the uh, Spin Tire Stomps Charger video. 
thank you so much for sticking with me, my dude. I'm gonna get yeah, that's the one thing about second. the... That's the one thing about these assassinators, is they do not like to... Yeah, just... There we go. Yep, I was gonna say, I'll just, like, help you out with that. Yeah. Go, 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 go. I love this high range. It's just short enough, but it's also just fast enough. Oh my god, oh my god, he is sending, he is, he is fully sent. Oh, he's gonna be okay. Yep, he's okay, all right. And as the yep. race continues, things are really heating up on the back stretch of the course. The powerhouse seems to be doing okay. And they're off. Powerhouse do powerhouse versus Psycho and a dually. Yep, pretty much. Oh, jeez. I was I was literally within inches of flipping. Ooh, your bumper ate mud though. Yeah, that would have been a second ago. Eight mud. Come on. Oh, also, side note, in No Limit 2, the Monte Carlo ran a 5.8. Bro, that's sick. I'm still trying to get my Supra to run a 5.7 again. I've done it once. No, I've done it twice. But after that, I haven't been able to make it do it again, and I'm really, like, desperately trying to make it do it again. Get Cindy. Get real, Cindy. Holy save. I just killed my suspension. Like That's what fully? happened. I killed my suspension. Like fully? Holy smokes. Do yep. you have repairs? Yep. Oh, good. I'm good. All right. I'm yeeting. I'm yeeting. I'm yeeting. Oh, 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 oh. God! Hello there. Hello there. Hello there. Hello there. Oh, oh, God. Oh, I'm stalling out again. I'm stalling out. Stalling out. Well, I was before, but I'm not now. I'm really scared for my uh, for myself and my truck with the upcoming balance obstacle combined with rear steer, and I might have to take it slow and not fall off uh, the edge. You're gonna send it yeah. out. Yeah. Sure. Well, actually, I'm gonna take it carefully on the concrete because I have the I have the width with the dualies, but the front ends, from the look of it, are just barely hanging on. Yeah, too narrow. Or just a little send too it. narrow. Oh, oh! I messed up right at the end. I'm a blithering Hammond idiot. Ouch. Note to self, don't use this bumper again. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, God. Oh, God. All right. There, 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 there it is. Full send. Full send, I think. You're going to have me. For the moment, at least. Just trying to be as careful as I can with... Oh my, well, how that worked out for you is beyond me, but I'm attempting to try to get myself back into my wheels. Well, you gotta be kidding. Oh, it's not gonna oh, be enough. No, no, no. Oh, oh my God. Is this gonna be my chance? Oh, no, oh, and I flipped right at the end too. No, nah, you had me. Wow. Oh, pull two more barrel so, rolls. So, wow. Well, I'll tell you something. What a way to finish up. That was so incredibly wild and amazing. And I'm going to go ahead and return to the main menu. But, oh my god. And I'll give you guys one last rundown of the official console mod drops as of today. Remember, you have the Blitzo truck as well as the new um, Spin Tires original remake truck by Ranger or RNG3R. But I'm going to go uh, back to no filters on here, obviously. Your latest trucks on console are where is it they up oh that's on maps i was like what in the heck that shouldn't look like that it shouldn't look like that all right so there's the blitzo truck that is on consoles right now blitzo truck by limes and the other latest console truck that has been approved is the rng g53 which is a remake of the starter truck from the original spin tires so with with both of those trucks being out on consoles i highly recommend checking them out and giving them a try but also, guys, thank you so much for hanging out with me. I know we ran a little bit longer, actually a good bit longer today than we normally do. And that's because, like, genuinely, like, and I always have such an incredible time with you guys. But today, you guys just, oh my god, I had such a blast. And I hope you guys did too. And remember to check back in on the channel at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We have a very interesting video going live that you guys will not want to miss. And I will, of course, be in that comment section to answer any 
questions or comments that you guys may have or uh, really address any concerns as well that you guys may have so once again Thank you all so much for all of your incredible, incredible, incredible support on, like, dude, every stream, every video. It's just such a freaking blast. And I have so much more that I cannot wait to share with you guys very, very soon. But with that being said, once again, thank you guys so much. Make sure you have those notifications on. And I will see y'all either in the next stream or at the 5 p.m. video. Peace out, y'all, and I'll see you guys next time.